Hello and welcome to No Man's Sky, everybody. I'm Alon Paul, and you're probably curious about this video because the first thing you're seeing is me on camera, and you're thinking, what, did I miss a live stream or something like that? No. We're doing a special video here. We're calling it a dead stream, okay? So basically, you're looking at this after I've already recorded it. Um, what we're doing today, and if you're looking at the screen right now, is we're going to be doing a Voyager's expedition. We're going to do sort of a speed run, not really a speed run, but it's going to be more of an exploratory speed run. So we're going to try to do the Voyager's expedition as quickly as we can. And the whole point behind it is that we want to try to see what we can do in order to speed run it. So I'm looking for systems and stuff like that along the way in order to be able to, you know, get what we need uh, and acquire the items that we need in order to play this. So that's what we're after at this point. So I'm going to scroll down here and we'll get a new game started on the Voyager and we'll talk about it a little bit more. Now I, in the first starter system, I've already learned that you can pretty much get at least nine milestones completed just in the first system alone before you even install your hyperdrive and leave. If things go well at the space station, you should be able to acquire enough copper and land on another planet in order to be able to uh, uh, get yourself enough chromatic metal to install your hyperdrive. Plus, with the nine milestones you accomplish, and by the way, you can get a tenth as well because you have to land and refine the copper into chromatic metal. You can get that tenth while you're there. We'll show you how to do that. Um, with all ten of them going, you should have enough to get out of that place. The problem is it's time consuming. You're going to be scanning everything. So you're not making a lot of money. A lot of guys have talked about... Um, the acquiring of nanites being the tough part. I've seen a couple people say that. You're not going to have a problem with nanites. You're getting um, about, how many nanites was it in the expedition? We'll check it here in just a second. Let's go ahead and get it started. And I'm going to start the timer going, as you can see on the right-hand side there. So we're going to get the, uh, we're going to look at where you get your nanites from. If you can discover all of the animals on one planet, on that very first planet you land on, that's 2,000 nanites right there you're done. That's all you need. You, you're you supposed to get about, what is it, 7,700, I think, nanites or something like that. But you will get, with every expedition, with every, um, pardon me, every phase that you complete, that you land on the um, final uh, rendezvous, every rendezvous you hit, you're getting nanites. Not to mention you have to discover an anomalous animals on six different planets. That's 250 nanites per animal. So you're going to get the nanites, no problem. That's not an issue. So keep that in mind. So here we are. We're starting. Let's check it out real quick. I'll show you what I'm talking about. So in the expedition, once you reach your rendezvous, you automatically get 1,200 nanites. That's five phases. That's 1,200 nanites apiece. That's 6,000 nanites. And in order to get to the nanite one, which I think is down here. Hold on a second. We'll find it. Is it two? I'm all over the place, right? Can't find it. I want to go back to phase five. One of these has, there it is, 7,700 nanites. So you get 6,000 just from reaching your rendezvous. You need 1,700 more. You're going to get 2,000 from the first planet. Done. You really won't have a problem. And even if you don't get that, you're going to discover so many animals and plants along the way that once you acquire them, you can go ahead and uh, turn them in for nanites. And you're not going to use every upgrade that you're given. So you can turn those in for nanites. Nanites, not a problem. So we should be able to, on this, set foot on land. Not a problem. That's one. Before we even warp, okay, we will discover all the creatures on two planets. Nearly all the creatures. That's two. Uh, we don't worry about that. Uh, let's see. We won't get this, but that's okay. You'll adopt two companions. That's three. We'll learn the Gek words. That's four. That's all before we even learn the first system. So four, four of the milestones on phase one you're going to complete. You will get to the top of the mountain. Five. Uh, let's see. Predator. You'll get that. Six. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Hold on. Uh, let's see. You won't harvest the plants yet. That's going to take some time. You'll get uh, the, your vortex cubes. That's seven. Tunnel underground. Eight. Let's see. Keep going, keep going. 80 units below C, 9. You won't get all 10 of these. You could. It's possible. No, no, it's not. It's not possible. You, you're not going to get that. So, so that's 9. And then destroy asteroids, that's 10. And that should be all you discover. You'll get 10 of them before you even get to your 
before you even leave. So the timer's going, but we're in the escape menu, so this is not counting right now. So you'll see what happens. Let's get started. So first thing you're going to do, run through your ship because you're going to get some free carbon. Get the carbon from these plants. As you can see as I'm going around, I've already got 200 and 70, 328. Look at that. So we're going to walk away with 600. The only problem is it's not going in your exosuit inventory. So you're going to need to stop for a second, go into your freighter, take it and put it in your exosuit. Keep your fecium here, take your sodium, put this in your exosuit. Oh, you don't need that. You don't need that in your exosuit. You need to put that in your freighter again. Okay, so we got the beginnings, if you will. Keep that, keep that. Sodium we're going to need a lot of. Let's move things around while we're here. So let's put our shields together and get them all taken care of. Uh, we're going to put our life support over here. Actually, we're going to put that right next to it. I'm going to put this over here and this over here. That'll give us a slight boost. Starship. There's no boosted areas on here. I like to put my photon cannon there and my rockets next to it. I'm going to put my hyperdrive here so I can utilize these three spots. You want, you might not get all of them, but I'd like to put it someplace else. Um, your pulse engine, we're going to stick down here. We'll line up our upgrades next to it and we'll stick you over here. So we're all set there. We don't need any of these on our person, so we're going to leave them here. Multi-tool, real quick. Stick this someplace that it's not going to affect anything. Uh, you're going to be upgrading your mining beam. You're going to need to do that. So put it somewhere where you can get some upgrades for it. Same thing with the scanner. Leave the three next to it. I suggest putting this guy just out in the open. So that way your scanner can be upgraded. you got to discover a creature worth over 200000 It's going to happen. It's pretty simple. So we're not worried about it. The freighter, even though if you don't fix your freighter's hyperdrive, you still can pull in your freighter anytime you want. So leave it there. So you're good. Let's get out of here. So we're done with the ship. It only takes 10 minutes to build up all that carbon again, which is a great thing. Whoop, wrong way. There we go. And as I always do, I switch to first person and give myself a hot key to do it. So look for the space station. And the planet should be right there, I think. Yep, AS. That's it. So we're going to head there. We're going to head there. We're not going to hit the space station because you don't have any money. Remember that. You have no credits, no nanites. You don't, you don't got anything. But your achieving all those milestones are going to get you what you need. You're going to get plenty of credits. You're going to get 320,000 credits just from one of those milestones you complete. So do them. And then all the other things you're going to acquire. we got to get some um, cytophosphates and things like that. Uh, not cytophosphates. The crystal, crystal sulfides. we got to get some of those. We're going to have to get a... Um, a pearl as well under the ocean. So we, we got to land at least twice on this planet, possibly three times. So the first thing we're going to do, we're not going to head towards the ocean. We're going to head towards a mountainous area towards the, the, towards the further north of where we're going right now, as you can see. So because we, we want to get up to the mountains, that'll give us a, a different achievement. And while we're at it, we got to get the asteroids. So next time some asteroids pop up, like right there, turn around. It was asteroids that I just passed through, right? I could have swore we just passed through a whole set of asteroids. I guess not. Must have been these guys. That's been happening a lot. The asteroid fields seem to have increased in occurrence. I just want to check one more time because I could swear that I'm going through an asteroid field. But no, I guess not. It must just be these big guys that I'm passing by. All right. So like I said, this is more exploratory. We're not going to really speed run this. All right. So you see we got some big hills here. Just land on top of one. Now if you want, do a quick scan when you get low enough. Ah, see we got a place down there. So we may have to climb, but let me just see if it has anything worth our time there. Because sometimes these little places like this, they will have a cave nearby. So I'm going to go ahead and land here. I can always climb a mountain. We're going to be doing some exploring. We'll be looking around. Eventually. There we go. Now, there's nothing here that's going to attack you. Well, that's not true. So we got the planet side. Let's just check in here because sometimes they'll have microprocessors and that's just a little less money spent. Hey, there you go. See? And take a quick peek. Look for subterranean relics. Now, we're not high enough to get the other achievement yet, but we're going to take care of that in just a moment. What do we got down here? We got four of them. We need six. 
do not delete or sell them until you achieve all six because because if you sell it and get rid of it it will automatically tell you you need to gather one more after that oh, there's some more right there 82 away we just need two more watch out for the bad guys yep we got them okay good one two and i'm gonna grab the third one anyway for a little extra cash so we've already got the vortex cube see that um, now, I'm not even bothering with trying to get, uh, I'll look at that even more, with trying to get anything in regards to uh, Cobalt, because we're, I'm going to show you how to get that real easy. So, one thing we're doing here, let me show you something. The reason I'm doing this, I'm digging, is because one of the things we have to achieve, besides summoning a mountain, is tunneling underground. So, I now selected it so I can keep an eye on it. You don't have to go far. Just go ahead and tunnel. Put it in its widest setting. You can even tunnel upwards, and you can see it still says you're digging. Digging down. Just carve this place out, man. That's all you need to do. And it's real quick. If you put it on its widest setting, it'll go real fast, and you'll be done with it. And we're already at 2,000. Almost done. There we go. That's another one done. Okay. So we just completed, what, three milestones in just a couple minutes. All right. So we're out of there. Let's go look for some creatures because there's some nasty boys around here. And we want to get the flying creatures too because they add up. It's not adding up as far as money's concerned, but it's to, in order to get other achievements. Uh, let's see. Anybody else? You are above. Let's go ahead and grab you. That's three. There's eight on this planet? Yes, eight. Eight there is. And I think we got the two flyers. There's two uh, aquatic creatures that we'll have to go after, but we'll get them later. Just go, scan everything. Scan plants. Except for... Um, Minerals, you don't have to scan the minerals, but you have to scan all the plants and animals for now until you're until we tell you otherwise. <laughs> and if you can, gather up... Whoop, that's not the setting I wanted. Try to gather up this stuff too, and hopefully you don't get attacked by any sentinels. We do need some dihydrogen at some point. We will get some from the space station, but it's good to have a little extra just in case you need to create some... Um... Life support gels. You are you are given one, but you might need one more. Okay, good. We got plenty of carbon. Condensed carbon's always a good thing. Not you. You. Okay. Wildly aggressive. That's the one. That's our hunter killer. So we've got that one now. What else we got? Let's look around. There's a guy over there. He's also aggressive. Okay, that's six of eight. That means we found all the land creatures and the flying creatures. So we're all done with that. We just need to go to the other place. Now, while you're here... Oh, got to get our achievement. <laughs> Don't forget to gather your achievements and your phases. Because, while we get that, we also get creature pellets. So now we can get pets. If I can just get these guys to stop doing that. And I'm going to go ahead and I do this automatically. Just pat them real quick, feed them something else, and then you can get rid of them. Get one more. And one more. We adopt. We're done. And we're going to go ahead. There's our, our other achievement right there. Okay, and we're done. And just to play it safe so I don't get them in my way, I'm going to go ahead and... There we go. Dismiss. Gone. Thank you, sir. Have a, have a good day. I don't need that. But you can scan it. Where'd it go? Nope, I already scanned it. What do you know? All right. Another thing we're going to need. We need a lot of oxygen. So gather up as much oxygen as you can while you're here. Condensed carbon's always your friend as well. You all know this. I don't have to tell you that any. Scan real fast. We got oxygen over there, which is just oxygen plants. But you got those wonderful little plants everywhere. Not these guys, but the... Uh, uh, hazardous ones like that gas producer over there. That's the one you want. What else are you looking for while you're here? Sodium. You need a lot of sodium. Like that. 
I'm going to try to take that plant out real quick so he doesn't chew my ankles again. Gas pod, and there's no... Uh, none of the sentinels around to stop me, so I'm going to take them out. Grab a little bit of ferrite dust. You don't need a lot right now. Again, you're going to get it from the space station. Always look around. Just look at everything. Scan stuff if you can't scan it. Watch out for the animals that will attack. Okay. I don't even bother killing those plants after a while because there's literally so many of them. It's not even worth killing them off. It's just wasting your time. These guys, I just like to get out of my way because they annoy me. They've taken me out in permadeath mode too many times. All right, looks like we got a predator coming at us. Sorry. I don't like killing animals indiscriminately. It bothers me, even if they're fake animals. All right, good deal. Let's keep going. While we're at it, you're going to get a bunch of uh, buried technology from some of the achievements you get. So by all means, you know, gather up more as you can, but don't go crazy with it. Look at all that. Boy, I almost wish I had a geology cannon. All right, we're going to have somebody objecting. There we go. All right, let's head not there. Go this way. All right, another plant over there. Good. More oxygen we can get, the better. There we go. If you can time it right, you can get in and out of there real quick. I got a predator right in front of me, so I got to be careful. Got him. Oh, nice. I'm just going to let him circle me. Oop, I didn't get much of a boost there. Okay, there we go. We're out of range. Okay. Now, one thing else we can look for is those, knowledge stones. You need words. So, you're on a Corvax planet, so you need six Corvax words. So, you might as well, or Gek, I'm sorry, Gek planet, Gek words is what you need, six of them. So, go ahead and grab those while you're here. All right, there's one. Here's number two. Okay, we got those. Do a scan if you want. Look for more stuff. Again, the more sodium you can get, the better. A lot of the plants have sodium already. Some of the rocks, I should say. So if you want to scan the rocks, that's fine. Oh, almost had it. Let's let them blow up again. Got it. All right. And there's no sentinels around, so I'm going to take them out. That gives me a good amount of oxygen. I walked away from this planet on one of my runs uh, with 800 oxygen. So, you know, how much, how much time are we at here? 16, which isn't quite accurate, as you know. All right, there we go. We're going to be selling that. I'm just going to get rid of that. We'll sell that. Let's use this, because we can use it. Let's go ahead and update you real fast. Anything else in here we need? I'm going to put that in our starship soon. Okay. I'll put you there, and we'll put you there. Okay, that's good. Rearranged. All right. Yeah, subterranean relics, like we don't need them. This is the first time I've actually run across so many subterranean relics, I actually didn't know what to do with them all. So, that's good. Where's our ship? Over there. Let's start heading in that direction. I would love to grab that, but it doesn't work. So, we won't. Like I said, condensed carbon, you need a lot of that, too, so. All right, good deal. There we go. Okay, we're good. Ammunition we don't really need. We're not going to be... Whoa, I don't want to run right into him. That'd be kind of stupid, huh? All right. 
Again, I'm going to try to get as much oxygen as I can. What am I up to? 573. I really could, I, I feel more comfortable when I'm over the 600, 700 range. Since we're hitting the space station, you don't have to gather all the words possible. I have no idea where that noise comes from. I'm picking up some kind of interference somewhere. I wonder whether it's my phone or something. Sorry. Kind of weird. Uh, ship. That way. Okay. Just want to get out of range of that guy. All right. Another predator. Up. Oh, let's scan the bushes. I think we already scanned those, didn't we? No? Okay, good. Okay, good. And that one. Get as many plants. You need a lot of plants in this one for some reason. I think it's like 26 plants that you have to scan. And I think I've scanned just about everything I can. Of course, there's going to be some plants that are underwater. We'll go ahead and grab those. Nope, that's not what I want. That and that. Okay, because I like to go first-person view to pick up buried technology. It's a lot quicker and easier, and I don't have to worry about putting stuff in my inventory I don't need. All right. Let's grab something from him. I've already gotten you. Never mind. All right. We should be good. I'm just going to grab another word while we're here. You know what? There's a knowledge stone and some buried technology guaranteed over here. Let's go ahead and grab it. Yep, it's right there. If it had Fecium, that would be great. We're going to need that later on, but we're going to find a planet that actually has Fecium, so... Let's see if we can get ourselves another microprocessor, maybe? Hey, cool beans. All right, and where'd that uh, technology go? There it is. Whoops, there we go. Got myself turned around. Yep, can't get that one. We'll just get it the old-fashioned way. Nice to have the extra. We don't get a ton of it, but it's nice to have extra. All right, anything else? I think we're pretty much done here. There's another knowledge stone up there, and you know what? If I don't have to talk to too many people at the space station, I'm going to go ahead and hit the knowledge stones, because I think this will be my sixth one. And I've got some oxygen over there we can grab, too. That should be it. Sodium. Good deal. So that's another milestone achieved. See? So now some people are going to see, hey, you know, oh, I don't want to shoot them. Yep, there we go. That's why. Let's get this one. I don't want to get too, too greedy here because we do need to get a move on. Uh, where are you? You're right there. Can I get you through here? No. Won't let me, huh? There we go. And it looks like it led right to a cave, too. All right, so that's good. Let's get out of here. Now I'm going to go ahead and hit that little save point. Not because I need it, but it's going to give me some uh, navigation data. And it's always good to have at least one on you, just in case. All right, we're going to head to the water now. Just in case you need it. You know, if you land at a landing pad or something like that, and you want to call your ship to you at the landing pad. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. I know it was discovered. Uh, there is the water. Let's head towards the edge of land right there. Actually, we want to head out just a little bit, so I might pick an island out there because we want to get deep water. we got to get down to 80. And just a little bit more. All right, that should be far enough. Let's get, let's head in. Now, procedurally generated means that I'm gonna have to wait until we get close to the water for anything to show up. There we go. Okay. 
Let's see. We got an island nearby I can land at. Gotta wait for him to show up. There's one. All right, there we go. So let's see what rewards we've gotten. We got one. This one we have to do yet. There's two. And this gives us upgrades to our exosuit, so we'll go ahead and take them. Uh, three, which gets us 320,000 units. Nip nip buds. Okay. See? See? We got plenty of credits now. Hunter killer. We'll go ahead and grab that. We're going to get stuff out of that. Let's go ahead and get the next one, which is the Vortex. Craftable components we don't really necessarily need. Fear the Sun. We've got our Glyphs. See that? Pretty good. Anything else? It looks like we got them all. So that's what? One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, we haven't gotten this one yet. We're working on it. Uh, we haven't done, done our Asteroids yet. We're working on that. So let's head back over here. So it's going to ask us as soon as we get in here to go ahead and build our hyperdrive. So let's just go ahead and put it in here. That way it's just there. We're not going to be able to do anything else with it. This needs to go in my exosuit. Um, you're not going to need these. Sell them in the space station. Um, what I would suggest doing with this is go ahead and you can sell that too. To be honest with you, we can buy almost everything we want. But if you go ahead and install it and then uninstall it, it's going to give you wiring looms so since those are expensive let's just go ahead and put them in there you have some empty spaces down here put stuff that you don't really do too much with down here out of the way where you can't see them because frankly you don't care like these we'll hang on to them for now all right and this we got some extra stuff so see we've already got 26 salvage data we got tons of it uh, sell about 10 or 15 of it so i usually sell about half my stack um, we're going to go ahead and get rid of that. I don't even need it. It's not even worth much. It's just 24 units. So keep the stuff that you need. Put this in your starship. This goes in your starship. Hang on to this for now. There we go. And we'll do that. We got stuff to sell, but we got more over here. So this is going to be something we're going to sell. This is something we're selling. This is something we're selling. And this is something we're selling. So we're going to sell all that and get rid of it. So we're in good shape. We're in really good shape, actually, to make some decent money. We're going to have millions of units in here see so we're in good shape let's get into the water and what you want to do oh man i got fortunate here didn't i okay we need crystal sulfides i i've been gathering about nine of them i don't know why it won't gather away from him there's a third one right there and a fourth one wow so I get nine of them in case I need them one thing else you're gonna need you're gonna need some pearls so I'll just look for them go ahead and scan some plants while you're down here might as well including this guy who gives you oxygen so while you're there grab it There we go. All right, so we need pearls. You also need to scan the fish. We got two of them to scan. There's one, and there's two. You've now discovered all the animals on this planet. So there you go. Pretty good stuff. Now, you're probably seeing a very strange background to me right now. I just got a china cabinet behind me. I'm just blocking some stuff out. Uh, there'll be people walking past. Just ignore it. We're all good. We're all good. All right, so we got a pearl and armor clam right up there. Let's get out, up out of the water here because of that. We'll go ahead and do the life support. We're going to use up that life support gel that we're never going to use otherwise. Okay, and we're out. Look for the per for the pearls. Look, look for those clams. We've got two of them about 200 units away. Our ship's over there. Let's head towards the ship, and we'll get this one. We need two. If we can. Did I? Yeah, okay. Just making sure I didn't get out of the water there. Okay, looks like they're straight below us. Let's go ahead and head down. And if you don't feel like getting damaged by the clams, just go in a first-person view. 
First person view. Just get close enough. One. And looks like there's another one right here. Two. I usually just get two or three of them if I can. There's one over there. I'll get three. We'll call it. Build up my jetpack again. And three. Let's head back to our ship. So this is great. So we've got... We're prepared, if you will. Now, a lot of people concentrate on getting ferrite dust and getting copper. Don't worry about it. You need chromatic metal. Don't worry about it. You'll be fine. Trust me. It'll work out. So, let's see. Let's go over here. Uh, we don't have any more phases that we complete, but let's go to our discoveries and get our 2,000 nanites. So, now we're really in good shape. Um, we have to get some asteroids. Let's go back to our expedition. So what else did we have to do here? We're going we're gonna to check out some more creatures on another planet. We only need six more. Um, we're not going to get this until later, but you will get it pretty easily. Let's go to two. Uh, we haven't summoned, summoned the mountain. I forgot to do that. So I'm going to do that real quick right now. All right, let's see. I'm going to check over these real quick. Plants are another story. So are the words. We've already tunneled. Okay, go over here. 80 units below sea level. See, I knew we were forgetting something. Down we go. Watch the depth on the left-hand side. You need to get to 80 units. Just go to your terrain manipulator. Widest setting. Just start digging. And... Achieved. Go back up, and you're done. See? Very simple. Just forgot to do it myself, so... Like I said, if I can remember to get these things um, in my mind to do as we're going, this is eminently so easy to achieve all of these milestones. Even though I've spent a half hour doing it right now, the next thing I need to do is find Frostwort. Believe it or not, I have been having a hard time finding it, because you really need to find the right world, the right icy planet that will carry them. All right, next thing, next place we're going right now is the space station. So let's go back there. Off we go. While you're there, while you're doing all that, go back to your exosuit and check things out. Like, we don't need to keep these on us. We can put it in the starship. We can put that in the starship. We're going to sell a lot of these things. So let's put them in their proper spot. Uh, let's see. I'm going to keep... Yeah, I'll keep 13 of them. And I'm going to put them in my starship. I'm going to keep this in my starship too. And these two, we're just going to go ahead and sell them off. Okay. We are going to be landing on that planet, the overgrown planet, in just a little bit. Uh, even though there's dissonance there, a lot of people say, hey, you know, go ahead and get the radiant shards and stuff. It requires you getting the mining beam and things like that. Don't, don't bother. Traders, let's check him out. Maybe he's got frost crystals. Uh, selenium. That was close. Selenium takes a while to grow. So I don't think I want to do that. We want frost crystals. They're the fastest growing plant. No, no, no. It's going to my capital ship again. There we go. I don't know why. It just doesn't lock in right. You get used to it. Oh, I think we're upside down. There we go. Okay. Hate that. Ugh, okay. <laughs> So granted, this is a bike about 30 minutes in or so. We're probably more along the lines of between 20 to 25 minutes. Now, I know Jason was able to do this in an hour and 50, uh, if I remember correctly. I heard the rumor, if you will. And that rec that was with planting plants. So I'm trying to figure out how he managed to do that because getting the plants is the next thing. Now, this station, they changed some stuff when they did the update. This station used to carry... Um, chromatic metal in it and I think they got rid of it uh, we're gonna go ahead and put that here okay and we're gonna go to him and we're gonna sell some stuff right well let's sell off those so we've got almost 3500 nanites he doesn't have much but the one thing I like to get is the thermal protection get that and get your movement module so at least it boosts you a little bit so we're gonna put that over here and we're gonna put you up there all right 
Um, he doesn't carry too much. I'll show you real quick. I always try to get the nanite, the nanites anyway while I'm here. Uh, let's see. Pulse engine upgrade, but you're going to get that anyway. And the hyperdrive one isn't worth getting. Really isn't. Um, this guy, he's got okay stuff, if I'm not mistaken. You're looking for scanner upgrades is really what you want. Yeah, yeah, he doesn't have a scanner upgrade here. That's right. Mining beam module is okay, but you've already got something better than that, so don't worry about it. Go ahead and grab those. Now, if I'm not mistaken, there was something in here you could get. Besides the ferrite dust, which grab it. See, that's the ferrite dust. Buy it. You've got this much. But go ahead and get rid of the stuff that you don't need, like this 13 salvage data. The vortex cubes you don't need. You don't need the feline livers anymore, the first spawn relics, the nip-nip buds, the descented bottles. You're not getting much money for them, but go ahead and get rid of them. And you see how much money we got now. We got one and a half mil. So you've got plenty of money to get stuff. Um, you don't need cobalt, per se. Grab a couple metal plates. Uh, you want some microprocessors. We've already got two, so I'm going to buy eight more. Uh, I'm going to get a couple wiring looms because I think we'll need them. One more. And pure ferrite. We'll need that. And ionized cobalt. Just get just get the full amount. You've got 822,000 left. So, whoop, I hit the wrong button. Now, the ships that are landing are going to have some stuff, so you might as well check them out. You're interested in magnetized ferrite. You are interested in copper. Sometimes you get lucky and they've got copper. Uh, grab the ferrite dust. It doesn't cost you much. Just grab it. Uh, we don't need really tritium at all. Got to get the asteroids. I did forget about that. Get dioxide. It helps you for your life support. Pyrite, obviously, for your ship. And that's all this guy has, so I'm not going to get anything more from him. There's a lot of ships that land here, so hit them all up. Ferrite dust again. We're going to grab some more. Uh, gold, yeah, we don't need that. We don't need any more pure ferrite. we got enough. Silver is another thing we'll need for building purposes. So, ferrite dust. Gold. Pure ferrite. Okay, let's get out of there. Okay, that guy left already. He's leaving. There's usually a few waves that pop through here. There's also two Corvacs, so go ahead and talk to them real quick and get their words. That's one. You got two by Keen, so go ahead and grab those two. Okay. One, two. Three. I'm going to do that real quick. Three, and this guy's number four. It's only four you can get. Two and two. Okay. Check the unit here. You see the ferrite dust is gone. We already got microprocessors. Copper. There's your copper. You do need salt. Grab it. And that should do it. So we definitely need magnetized ferrite. And some of these guys that are landing are going to have it. So go ahead and check them out. And you might get lucky. Like I said, if they have more copper, that's great. But the system we go to next... I'm going to grab more of that. Uh, might have... You have nothing for me. You are terrible. Go away. Get this guy. Hi. Let's see what he's got for us. Got ferrite dust. Let's do it. He's got silver. Let's go ahead and grab the silver, and we could use a few of those. So let's grab about 10 of these. All right. And you see we're still over 500,000. We're not going to have to buy much more. We're interested in getting the magnetized ferrite if we can get some. We've got another ship landing to our left. Because we definitely need that. Magnetized ferrite. There we go. And I, you don't really need more of it. Just get what you can. We don't need more silver or anything else. So let's go ahead and get out of here. Oh, that ship is missing. I thought there was a ship landing there. Maybe it was the one that was taking off. We'll hit this one last guy here. Just in case. Because you never know. And what do we got? Silver, pure ferrite. No, we're okay. That should do it. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and get out of here. So we have to make ourselves a refiner. And we got to land on a planet. So we're just going to go straight to this planet right here. 
We want to be near the ocean because we have aquatic creatures we need to discover and other animals. So get to a, a spot that's near large bodies of water. Yeah, that'll work over there. If you can find yourself someplace to land that has a landing pad and save yourself a little bit of fuel, that'll be great. And I think you already remember I have forgotten to go land on a very tall mountain. So we'll have to get that later. Interesting. That was a landing pad and it never showed up. Interesting. Good. Save ourselves a little bit of launch fuel. So we never got the uh, very tall mountain, but we'll go ahead and get that before we leave. It'll be a kind of a broken speed run, but you'll see what we do. Another microprocessor. How nice. Been fortunate with, with those. Uh, so while we're here, let's put down a portable refiner. And we're going to fuel it. We got plenty of condensed carbon. Uh, where's our copper? go and while it's busy let's discover some creatures shall we one we need to discover six more so that's two there's three any flying creatures around well we'll get one more here in just a minute let's head let's head under the water Okay, plants. Get what plants you can. Okay. Just going to go under water a little bit, see if I can get some of the sea creatures to pop up. See, the land creatures have finally disappeared. There we go. One. Two. Three. Okay. And we got six of the ten. So there we go. Fourteen new species. So you got that one now. Got the mountain. That really upsets me a little bit. Kind of upsets me a little bit. All right. Okay. That's done. Before we go. I'm just going to keep a couple out. That should give us plenty of the hydrogen. So we got chromatic metal, so guess what we can do now? There we go. Done with that. Now we can only make three antimatters. So I'm not even going to bother trying to make the fourth because it's going to tell me I'm, I don't have enough antimatter. Or chromatic metal. So that gives us charged. So we're done there. Let's put the rest of our stuff in there. That is in our starship. Get rid of that. We don't need it. That in our inventory. This is for oxygen. I'm going to go ahead and switch those around. We're going to get plenty of dihydrogen. Ferrite plus. Good. Plus plus. This goes into our ship. We didn't get any uranium. So I really am kind of a bummed out about that. But that's okay. So we see we're almost out of chromatic metal. That's all right. Don't worry about it. Okay. We're all set, right? There we go. Well, let's get going. So, again, the only one we didn't get was the tall mountains. That was my fault. I messed up. Is what it is. Hold on. Okay. Let's get our asteroids while we're here. Yeah. I'm shooting straight today. Hmm. So... Sorry I haven't seen everybody in so long, and I'm sorry I haven't done a live stream, but things have just been really crazy lately, and I haven't had a chance to do a live stream, so I apologize. I do have some other content I do want to do, and I've just been really enjoying the relaxing lately, so I don't get burned out. But I felt it was necessary to get one of these put out there after I watched, watched an episode from somebody else that did a... Kind of a test speed run. I think I just shot him. 
Great. Let's find it because he accidentally swung right in front of me while I was shooting. Uh, is that over here? Yeah, it is. 30. Let's see, how did we do? Four more. One, two, three, and four. Okay, that should be it. Got it. Correct the reward. Let's collect this reward. Yeah, thank you for the marine shelter. Oh, crap. Did it just put something in my inventory I need to get rid of? Naturalist. Yeah, don't worry. We'll get out of the way in a minute. You're probably wondering to yourself, what is he doing? Why isn't he running away? It's okay. Everybody will be all right. Yeah, I want to grab one. Okay. Uh, so is that Lumber Corporation? I love it. Bless you, sir. All right. Where are my planets at? Is that the planet I'm looking for? No. Oh yeah, that is the planet I'm looking for, isn't it? I'm just going to wait until it tells me I can go ahead and leave. There we go. So we're just going to head back there real quick. We're going to land on the planet and then leave. It'll just take us a moment. Now granted, you're looking at the timer right now uh, at the top on the when you're looking at me, it's on the opposite side. And you're thinking, crap, he's wasting so much time. Again, this is just an exploratory run. We're not really trying to do it as fast as possible. All right, what do we got? Let's get rid of these guys. We've got plenty of gold that we can sell if we want to. This is the terrifying sample I wanted to make sure we sold, because that gives us another million. Get rid of this. You don't need it. Get rid of that. You don't really need it. This can go in your freighter. All right, I think we're good. And I'll put this over in my other ship. This I'm going to go ahead and grab, because you never know when you might need them, to be honest with you. You don't help at all. Go away. We're going to sell that. Bounce? Nope, I didn't bounce. What do you know? I thought I'd bounce off the atmosphere. Sometimes you do. This is very handy. Please tell me it's got fauna. Nope, mineral. Useless. But that's okay. Not terribly useless. So we got mountains where we're at. Let's land on top of one. All we need to do. That one's taller. Let's land on top of that one. We need 625 feet. Okay. Wow. Well, that was a weird view. Did we get it? Got it. Okay. Let's grab the... Reward is over here. Okay, so there it is. There's all your rewards. Let's check it out. Again, we got four, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. So you've done ten milestones in just that short amount of time. All right, let's get out of here. So I'm going to go ahead and leave, and we're going to get going here. It looks like I got a thermal protection as well for cold. I like that galaxy map. Now one thing I always do here, or I have been doing here, is I'm not going to the first world, which is right here. Uh, there's one that's named L1. Somebody went a little nuts and just named it something strange. I think it's right here. 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 It's around here someplace. Hold on. I don't even know who named it. I, I suspect I know who named it, but no, that's okay. Hmm. It's not, oh, there it is. Okay. All right. The reason I'm going here is for a very important fact. This system sells chromatic metal. So now we don't need to mine any copper. We just go here, land at the space station, get our chromatic metal, get the heck out of here. There's a second bonus here is that there's a scaly planet here, so we can get our first anomalous creature here as well. Let's go ahead and get that done. I wish there was a frost planet here because that would have been more handy, but it is what it is. 
Interstellar went to light speed, so there's our 11th milestone. And we can also pull in the anomaly now. I think, right? Nope, no anomaly yet. We have to get some place that will allow us to pull in the anomaly because the anomaly will allow us to get our hazmat gauntlets and get our uh, upgrade for our starship. Because we can't get it any other way. Well, you can get it another way, but it's better just to get it right away. Same thing with the hazmat gauntlets. Because you're going to need them to get your frost crystals and you might as well get them as quickly as possible. So I'm going to hit, hit here first. I don't need any more ferrite dust. Here's the chromatic metal. See? Uh, let's see. Uranium. Yes. Let's grab that. We're going to sell. Start at the top. Work our way down. There. Get a lot of money for that. And marine shelter. Okay, we're done. Oh, while wow, we're here. Learn some words. So that's three. Not you. You. Okay, so this is number four. This should be five. I think we need seven. Six. And don't talk to him. Talk to him, I think. Warrior. Nope, not him. Him. Seven. That should get us that achievement. Set some people up. There it is. And what do you got for me, pal? You got salt. I don't need that. You got uranium. I already got it. Okay. Go find someone real quick. Let's see if anyone has chromatic metal. Because that's the only thing. I just want to get one more hit of chromatic metal and then we're done. There it is. That should get us almost 800 chromatic metal. So we should be good. We shouldn't need any more. So let's go ahead and get out of here. Land on our scaly planet and we should be ready to go. Our next system. Now, we are in desperate need of finding... Let's just see which planet it was real quick. I'll go ahead and get the uh, reward. And now we can make a base and get our other reward. Emerald 440, you need that. King, hang on to it. Okay. Discoveries. Uh, let's see, which one was it? It was uh, infected, ash shrouded, chromatic, overgrown... Paradise. Was it this guy? Nope, that's not it. Infected. Ash shrouded? No, that's just dark. I mean, uh, hot. Hot house, rainy planet. Where'd it go? Overgrown. It might have been this planet I was landing on. Oh, it's the next system. It's the next system. My bad. Let's go ahead and get out of here. My bad. I forgot. And we're just going to keep keep the path this time. So go to the next system, was, uh, which is this one. I'm not even going to try to pronounce it. It's not important. And we'll see what we can do. There is a scaly planet here, so this will be our first anomalous creature. There didn't seem to be anything else here. I think I landed at the space station, if I remember correctly. Scan some plants while you're on the planet. And you need more aquatic creatures. That was weird. What was that? Advanced translated. Oh, it's it's upgrading. Okay, so super critical, iridescent, misty. One of these is scaly. Spined. That was it. Spined planet. That's the one we're going for. Okay. All right. So what do we get? We got a prepackaged teleporter unit. Yes. Put it in your ship, please. This is your advanced translator. You don't need it. Hang on to it for now if you want to sell it. Weapon shard, you really don't need that either. Alright, good. Let's go back to our exosuit. We have this one that we're going to keep. This one we don't need. We can sell that. And I'm just going to hang on to this for now. I'll put it down here. See? 
nice, nice amount of chromatic metal now. Now again, you know, if this was a speed run, I'd be in trouble because I would really need to plant some plants. We've been talking, they, they have been talking, I haven't been talking much. They have been talking about possibly having a planet that everybody can go to and harvest the 18 plants just to get past it. Scan your plants. One. That's a mineral. There's your animal. Okay, good deal. So you get your first anomalous animal. The thing about getting the anomalous animals, by the way, and this is what I said before, is that now you can go ahead and get, that's inorganic, the achievement, which gives you 250 more nanites. So, you know, I think I'm doing pretty good as far as that's concerned. I didn't have to do anything special to get them. All right, let's get out of here. We don't need this system anymore. Let's go on to our next one. Okay. We should have enough juice in our hyperdrive to get to the next system, which should be our first... Yep, it's our first uh, milestone. Uh, rendezvous. Pardon me, rendezvous. Off we go. Excellent. Now, this is about as far as I've gotten in most every single test run that I've been doing. So everything else from this point forward is going to be really a test. So hopefully you enjoy this. I'm going to keep the camera on so you can see me blabbing. All right. Kind of making believe. That's why I said it's not really a live stream. It's a dead stream. I like that. My daughter named it. Uh, terraforming catastrophe. No, that's not what I want. Let's not doing this right. There we go. Let's see what we got. Terraforming catastrophe. If it has one, no planetary fauna. Don't bother going. Flourishing. Windswept. Icy abhorrence. We've got frost crystals there, but we got to be able to pull in, and we got a paradise planet too. We got to be able to pull in a um the 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 anomaly. Can we do it yet? Yes, we can. All right, let's do this. We've got plenty of nanites. We've got enough uh, technology of the uh, buried variety. I can't talk right now. Hold on. Enough uh, salvage data. That's the word I'm looking for in order to be able to get what we need. So we need hazmat gaunts. We also need the indium drive. Now, if I'm not mistaken, let's check this out real quick. The timer can continue running. I think you get it. Visit a red star. One of these, I think, gives you auto charger. That's very nice. Very nice to have. Supreme mining beam upgrade is always good. Launch thrusters. Nice. Yes. But that's a red star. So is it in here that we get it? It should say... See, there's the, uh, the, the hazmat gauntlets, but I'm going to get them in advance. Deep freeze, which we're going to get here. Specialized warp blueprints. This is the one. we got to build a wonder projector, which means we got to go to a planet that has storm crystals. So that's going to be kind of fun to find the planet that has storm crystals. But I remember that one of the planets we land on has them. So we should be in good shape as far as that's concerned. But that would require us waiting. Let's go. Up, 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 up. Good, good, good. Now what we can do, I think we can hit the guys out there and get more nanites. I don't remember. Uh, let's start with you. Hello there. What do you got for me? So we need that. In order to get there, we got to spend some nanites, but that's okay. We don't really need anything else. If you want to get an economy scanner or something like that, hey, that's up to you, pal. Um, I'm not going to worry about it. Ugh, I hate that. They always kick you out. There we go. So we've spent a decent amount. I'm not going to go for anything else. There's really nothing else in here I need right now. So we're going to go ahead and get out of here. Uh, here, construction research, if I'm not mistaken. There we go. I don't think there was anything I needed here, but I'm going to take a quick peek through... 
Oh, yes, of course. And you need Frostward. There you go. Dioxite, which is why we've been getting Dioxite too. Probably could use a little bit more of that. Let's see how much Dioxite we have. I should have gotten more. Yeah, I should have gotten a lot more of it. Okay, so that's a lesson learned. Okay. SO suit upgrades, just the hazmat gauntlets is the only thing we really need. You will be getting a refiner later on, so you might want to just hold off on that. You're not going to need it right now. Uh, but we do need dioxide. I'm going to have to keep my eye open. Nothing else is needed in here. But while you're here, if you feel like spending the uh, money on it. Uh, let's see. I am going to put it over here this time. All right. And we do need some other things. We need... We don't need any multi-tool upgrades. We could get the A-Class, but it's not really important. I seem to recall we needed something in here. Oh, yes, of course, the warp. You're going to get the Atlas Passes. They're going to give them to you, but you're not going to have the recipes for them. So if you have the Nanites, please spend them and get you your Warp Hypercore, because you will need that. Um... You can get the hydrothermal fuel cell if you want. You don't really need to power that thing up or use it. The only thing you really need to do is just use it, use the scanner on it, and you're going to get that anyway. So don't worry about that. Okay, that should do it. Pretty sure we got everything we needed. I don't think you can get nanites from these guys. I think it would be considered almost like a form of cheating, like if you go to Ares and you turn something in. But let's find out, shall we? You may tell us, take a hike. Uh, let's see. Milestone data? See how much he gave us. Oh, he did give us 750 nanites. Cool. So we're going to get this achievement a little quicker than we thought. Let's do the same thing here real quick. Oh, no new discoveries. Okay, that's fine. So there we go. So we already have that many more nanites. Uh, if you want to see where we are in the scheme of things, I think that was down here. Yep, we already got 4,500 nanites. We're about to get 1,200 more, so that'll be, what, 60, that'll probably be 5,700 or so, give or take. So we'll be 2,000 away. So really nothing more to do here. Let's move on. All right, so we are done inside here. We'll go back here one day, but it's not important right now. Moving on. Next. Just as soon as we exit, we got to go to the Icy Abhorrence planet, which I'm hoping, I don't recall or not, whether it has the ice crystals or not, or the frost frost crystals. So first things first, let's get to our exosuit and install hazmat gauntlet. We need sodium nitrate, but that's okay. We'll get some later. Uh, it doesn't take much for us to do that, so no big deal. Uh, where is the planet that we're looking for? Is it over here? Is that it? Yes, it is. It says it's got frost crystal, but I don't know. I, I really don't know. I think I was searching one time, and I could not find the frost crystals. And you're supposed to be able to go in here into your catalog and actually go to materials, looking for uh, plants. Okay. Frost crystal supporting planet detected, and we can use this to look for them. Okay, so we'll see what happens here. Because we really need those. And if we have to, what we'll do is we'll plant, we'll put our base here real quick. And we will... I guess, plant some plants. And we'll come back to our base whenever we want. be kind of weird. I don't know if I want to do that here, but... We're over an hour, so let's see how well we can do this. Well, this temperature, huh? All right, let's just land real quick. Hopefully not near something that's going to attack us. Let's get some plants. Just make it a habit of yourself to do so. 
Hopefully there's nothing else out here. Now, let's go ahead and do C. Target suite. Let's go ahead and go back into our log. Let me just make sure. Locate. Hmm. It's not going to let me locate them. All right, so what we'll have to do, let's just see if we can find any plants here. I, Like I said, I don't think this planet is conducive to producing cross crystals. Ah, good. That's going to get us our achievement. Let's go ahead and wait around just a couple minutes. One more scan. We need some sodium. What are we doing on sodium, by the way? We do have enough. Let's go ahead and get some sodium nitrate while we're here. Do, 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 do. I think we just need 20, if I remember correctly. Yep, I was right. Good. Done. And there it is. We got that achievement. So at least we got that, but we haven't found cross frost crystals, so that kind of stinks. Uh, so we can install our, our cadmium drive, too. No, not there. There we go. Good boy. Cadmium, which we have. That's not what I wanted. I just realized it was the wrong one. We want the indium drive. There we go. That's what we want. And you can see we, all, we already need more warp hyper cells, so... Yeah, like I said, this planet doesn't seem conducive to carrying what we need. As far as frost crystals are concerned. Because it is one of these abhorrence planets. And everything on this planet is just covered in this garbage that they have down here. So I'm going to go ahead and call it here. We'll go ahead and get out of this place. It says locate them with frost It really does believe they're here. What do you think? Think we should give it another shot? Like this is a live broadcast, but it isn't. It's dead. I really thought we could find some on this planet, but... All we got is these little red things that are floating around all over the place. Very technology. That's kind of nice. Yeah. I really don't think we can find it here. It's a shame, because it's the first icy planet you come across, but I really don't think you're going to find it here. All right, so there's nothing here for us except our rendezvous. Where is that rendezvous at? This way. It is there. Not far away, is it? Eh, not that far at all. Let's go ahead and recharge certain things. Our launch thrusters could use that. I'm going to use this for now so we can empty that out. Um, let's go ahead and recharge our pulse engines. We got a lot of tritium. Let's use that. That should do it. We need to do our hyperdrive. I may go ahead and put in one more right now. And we'll do that. There we go. Excellent. So we're going to hit this rendezvous. This will give us 1,200 more nanites, and we'll be good to go. Yeah, it was a long way away. So we'll, you know, for, for the intents and purposes, that system that we go to for our first rendezvous, um, obviously we don't want to go to that icy abhorrence again. It's a waste of time, and we're just we're just wasting minutes here. And since the frost crystals take an hour to grow, I'm already going to be beyond the two-hour mark easily, even if I could get them now, right this second. So, let's see if we can get them at the next system we go to. And, wow, locked in on it. Now, the rendezvous, first one is always, I believe it's an archive, if I remember correctly. So hopefully, if you're fortunate, while you're flying, you will get the archive appearing almost instantly. There we go. Upper 
platform, please? Hello? There we go. And we're done. You know, it would be a good thing if we could find some dioxide, wouldn't it? And achievement now. There we go. Let's see what we got. Nope. That was worth a shot. Just wanted to see if they did. And as you know, with these places... Oh, look at that. A beautiful exotic is landing. Isn't that pretty? Ugh. What a pretty ship. Love exotics, I really do. What do you got for me, pal? Cactus, flesh, and pugnium, huh? You're not helping. If there's someone on the next to me, I'll go ahead and check it out, but there isn't, so I'm going to go ahead and get out of here. All right. Let's go. So we're going to go on to the next system. We still haven't put a base computer in yet, but that's okay. Let's keep going. So I'm going to go to the next place in the system. I'm going to go here. We need to start checking out space stations and looking for hyperspace upgrades as well. Sooner or later, we're going to start hitting um, space battles, and we're going to have to be very careful about those. The last time I played and I got into a space battle, I was able to get out of it pretty easily, but I don't want to take those chances too much longer. Let's see what we got. All right, good. Nothing here yet. Black market, it said. Pirate system. Where are you? There you are. There. Let's go ahead and land there first. And while we're going in, let's pause for a second, take a look. We got a new reward. Let's go ahead and get that. We'll get our upgrades. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and put it up here first. And then we'll put it down there. Okay. Okay, we've got some expansion slots added to us. Collect the reward. Okay. Alright, so what we got here? Trade rocket. Well, we'll put it in there. We don't really need it. Uh, starship. What else we got here? Scanner module. Upgrade S-Class. Give us what we're looking for, pal. Fauna, 6,000. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Okay, good. Uh, we don't need that. Let's go back to the starship for a minute. Okay, there's no other upgrades in here that we need. Okay, good. All right. Ah, pretty solar ship, huh? So many cool ships in this universe here. Uh, Gravitino Ball, Sac Venom... Gold, nothing I can really use. All right, let's hit the trader real fast. We may be checking out for uh, X-class hyperspace upgrade. Do we have anything to sell? I don't know if we did or not. Let me check here real quick. The gold. We didn't need the gold. Let's go ahead and get rid of that. All right. What do you got for me, pal? I need dioxide if you have it. Uh, nothing really worth my time. All right, let's look for upgrades. Again, we're looking for hyperspace. What do we got? Shield, infra knife, pulse, scanner, mining, hyperdrive. Okay, we got a couple of them. I'll get two of them. Uh, no shovel caster, face beam, scatter blaster. And that's it. Scanner module. Eh, we'll go ahead and grab it. All right, let's see what we got. We went shopping. Let's see what we got. What's that give us? Whoa. Okay, that's going to definitely help. We're going to keep that. Uh, hyperspace. 80 more, more, more light years. And what did you give us? 100 light years. Excellent. So our, our, hyper, our hyperdrive range is now 361. Very good. All right, so we're all set. We're good there. I don't really need much else. Um, oh, you know what? I forgot we have stuff I can sell you. 
uh, cell. Underwater and repackaged thermal layer unit. Anything over here? Translator and the weapon shard. Okay, good. So we got plenty of it. I think that might have got us where we needed. No? Not yet? Okay. Alright. Anybody else land in here that I can check to see if they have dioxide? Nobody? Okay, let's get out of here. Moving on. Alright. Check out our planets. We've got Scaly, so if we want to do that, that's going to have the one Fauna, so that'll get us another anom anomalous guy. Damp, and what's over there? Fecium? We need Fecium. Copper, overgrown, Sporal. Oh, we got two planets here. Sweet. Rattling? That's three. We have three planets here. Scaly, Rattling, and Sporal. That'll get us three of our upgrades. So Anawara uh, is the name of the system. I think I'm actually literally going to write that down. So this is right after our Rendezvous 1. Anawara next system. Because this is very much worth our time. Uh, are any of these planets cold, though? We've got a rattling, we've got the reeking, reeking overgrown, and damp. The damp one that has the fecium is going to be very handy, because we definitely need fecium in order to... Oh, this one does, too. Okay. Inconspicuous mud hole. That is hilarious. I've never seen anything like that before. Fabulous. Okay. So we've got some work to do here. All right, what are you... First planet, rattling. Got aggressive sentinels, that's okay. We don't really need to stay. So we're going to get a lot done here. I wish we could plant our plants. So the planting of the plants is going to be the problem that we're going to have with this uh, with this being a, any kind of a speed run that's worth our time. Is that a... It is. We can land here, I think, unless it's uh, abandoned. There it is. Excellent. I'll take it. It is abandoned. That's weird. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. Just give me an animal. There's one. There's another. I'll take it. You're done. Let's go. Oh, and the creature's already worth 200,000 units. Look at that. Nice. Is that... What did we just get? Priceless, right? Alright. And we got the personal refiner Mark II, which we can install. We need two magnetic resonators and three quantum computers if we want to install it. But we don't have to. Okay, so we're good here. That's worthless to us. I don't know why we even have that. Uh, let's see. Any other... Nope, that was it, huh? Okay, good. We still need to establish a base. We haven't done that yet, but that's okay. Where's our next uh, world at? Got to go here. There we go. I'll figure this out. Don't worry. Y'all can help me if you wish. Reeking. Okay, that's the one that has fecium, which we needed. That was kind of creepy looking. That's damp. Little prime. And you are overgrown moon. And how far away are you? You are 1775. And you are 1476. I think we want to go there first, because that's going to be closer. Uh, before we do, are any of the other planets close by? You. How far away are you? Scaly. 968. And you? Sporal. 1498. Let's get to this one. Off we go. Well, what, what a fortunate system you come across in this. So you get three of these planets. That's going to give me all f uh, four of six of the anomalous creatures, so we're in good shape as far as that one's concerned. That was one of the one uh, one of the milestones that was really concerning me, is finding all these anomalous planets. It should be a piece of cake at this point. Any system we go to, check what planets, land on one. And once we've got all six, you're done. You don't have to look for those planets anymore. We still need to find an icy planet so we can get our frost wart for, from. 
So what I'm going to do, I will probably at some point on my own see if I can discover a system close by between, between the starting system and Rendezvous 1. So we found the first system that gives us chromatic metal. Great. I need to make sure I get more dioxide because we need it. And then the second one I need to find. This is pretty cool. Uh, I'll land right here. And the second one I need to find is... Um, let me get all this real quick. All right, good. Plants. And then we can get... Well, the other things that we need, of course, I'm kind of losing track of what I'm doing here. What kind of plant is that? Pulpy. All right, I think we've got all the things. You. All right, is there any more nearby? I thought there was. There isn't. Wow. Where's my anomalous animals? That's really, really strange. I mean, it was there a moment ago. You saw it as well as I do, didn't you? Plant life. Let's go ahead and grab it. Nutrient source lost travelers. Oh, that is just creepy. Are you kidding me? Let's get out of that hole real quick. Maybe just getting out a little further will make them appear, maybe? No. I mean, you saw it as well as I did, that there was one little red dot that was appearing. And how nobody's there. There it is. I can't seem to get it to... There it is. Got it. Wow, that was crazy. Ow. Okay. All right, we're done there. Okay, so we should have a planet nearby. Sporal, that's the one we have not landed on, correct? Let's see. Yeah, that's right. We landed the rattling planet. Scaly. And we gotta go to Sporal now. Let's go. Come on, baby. There we go. Alright, so we're doing pretty good there. So we need to find really a nice, uh, like I said, an icy planet somewhere in, the, in there. We found the nice system that has the chromatic metal. We can get a lot of dioxide from our main system that we started at, so we got to remember to get all that. Um, we haven't even been to the space station here yet. We ought to check that out. See what we could find. Oh yeah, we, that's right. This is the pirate system, right? Yeah. So we've been there. You lose track of these things. I'm very sorry. Don't know what I'm doing half the time, right? Get out of that. I hate that view. Let's check things out. No? Alright, this looks good. Wide open. Scan some plants. That's a plant, sure enough. There's our anomalous animal. 281,000 is what these are worth. Okay, we're not finding any plants, I see. That's inorganic objects is what those are. Yeah, okay. All right, not going to worry about any of those. Let's go ahead and get going. All right, so that's all three of those. We need Fecium. Let's get that next. Get a little ways from the planet. Alright. That one's our furthest one. I believe. Reeking is at 3,000. We've already been there. Uh, let's check. Hold on. Uh, you. I think we we were just there. That's rattling. Yes. There's another planet beyond it. There's you. And then all of you. 
All right, so we want to get beyond these planets. There's one beyond it, so let's head that way. And if we're fortunate, we won't be attacked by pirates on the way. I mean, we can. If we have to fight, we... That usually means we are going to get attacked at some point. When you have the fugitive starships. Shroomsh. Shroomsh. Interesting name. Object of interest. Why not? What does he want? Uh, you want to trade? Hey, he's got Fecium. I kind of needed that. I think that might be all I needed. Well, I don't need anything else from you. Let's let's check something here real quick. My freighter has 225. It might be enough. I think I need 300. So, let's keep going. Yeah, you've already told me that. Okay, what do you want? This guy has BCM. I'm going to... And he's got frost crystals. We need a lot more frost crystals, I'll be honest. That's nowhere near enough, but... What are the chances? I now have enough... Fecium. Let's check. Yeah, yeah, we got enough Fecium. I'd need about 800 more... Frost crystals, but... We should have plenty of Fecium now. Let's, uh... I guess get going. Very crazy. All right. Let's go this way. Over here. Excellent. Now, one of these systems, this is our Rendezvous 2, should have an icy planet that we can get what we need. Frost crystals. Very odd. Two traders back-to-back -back like that, and they both had enough ECM for me to get hit by. It's almost like it's listening. Very strange. All right, where are we? This should also have a paradise planet, I think. That gives us our... Nope, it's later on. Okay, it's not this one. But, nice place to set up a base. Just saying. Alright, so. Back in here. Back over here. What do we got? Icebound. There's our frost crystals. This could be kind of hard to get them because of aggressive plan of the aggressive nature of the sentinels, but that's okay. There's our paradise planet. Temperate. Foggy. And... Foggy again. So we got to go to this one, and we'll probably set up base over here. We might even just set up base here. I don't know. Maybe. I don't know. Might be worth it. Okay. Before we do, let's go to the space station. There you are. Hi there. All right. Good deal. I'm interested in getting dioxide. Whoa. Okay. That wasn't dizzying at all. Alright, so we have our hazmat gauntlets. Alright, let's see what we can find here. Oh. Got the two big eyes on the front of this guy. It's funny. Uh, this is a Gex system. Gotta remember to get our words. Use your words. Uh, what do we got? Nothing I can use, but no dioxide. That's the important part. Okay, so we should have at least two creatures of the other species. We got our Viking, we got our Cor Corvax, right? No, we haven't gotten the Corvax yet. Got the Gek. We'll take you. Okay, that's it. All right, we'll hit you up and see if you have some dioxide in your inventory. Oh, hello. Mr. Sales Gek, what do you got? Nope. Ain't got it. Hmm. 
Not a very decent system, just to say. Wow, check out that weapon. Hmm, nice, huh? No, no it's not. Alright, so we don't need anything from them anymore. We're actually done with that. Let's go ahead and get to the trade terminal. And hope that they have dioxide. Yay, we're in good shape. Alright, we're good. Good to go. Boink. I'll check you anyway. Well, why can't I get past his wing? That was weird. Yeah, I'll grab it. You never know. Might need more. And wouldn't it be funny if these guys had, like, frost crystal on them? Just like to check. You never know what you might come across. All right, we're good. I'm not going to bother with the last guy. We're going to go ahead and get going. All right, so frost crystal, here we come. All right, so there's our paradise planet. Where is our planet that has cold? I don't think it's you. It's foggy. How about you? You are temperate, which is another form of icy power. Ooh, that must be it. Ice town. Yeah, I'm guessing you're it. All right. So we're going to be setting up base probably here. I was thinking about setting up base on the other planet um, that has the... I need to get this set up. Um, setting up base on the, on the third rendezvous, which just has the uh, portal on it. But we should be able to get there any time we want. Do I take a chance? I'm just curious. Yeah, you can have my hermetic seal. Have a nice day. Just gives us more nanites. That's cool. I didn't need the hermetic seal anyway. Just one last thing in my inventory. Alright, so we need to find frost crystals. Let's go straight down. And look. Now we can jump out of the ship and scan, but this is aggressive sentinel territory, so we gotta be careful. Ah, look at that. Frost crystals. Right there. Okay. Right here looks good. First things first. Right away. Remember, we can set up bases anywhere we want. We can put a base on the other planet too, not only thinking about it, but... Come on, bring us back in. Or we get attacked. more. There we go. Need a door. That's what our pure ferrite was for. And we need some some roofing. Got it. And we got it. Establish the base. I don't know why I did that. Okay, there we go. Do-do-do. Okay, we need you, which means we'll need power, which we don't have. So we are going to put this on our ship. Yeah, 25 dioxide. We need a lot of frost crystals. Let's get them. Nope, do not grab those. Got somebody chasing me. That was not oxygen. And we got a lot of guys following us. Okay, anything else? <laughs> this is crazy. Before we go, hold on. 
Remember we had this done. Location service unavailable, so it's not going to let me find them. What is that? Oh, okay. Sorry, it looked really weird having this here. No, this is really great. I got sentinels chasing me, and I've got really mean animals. <laughs> What's the chances? Frozen tubers, frostwort. All right, how many do I got? Frostwort, freighter. We probably put it on the freighter. 490. We need about another 400 or 500 more. Let's go ahead and grab those. That was hilarious. I remember finding this planet, I think, one time, and I ended up landing, and there was tons of frostwort in a one area, and that all that frostwort was just incredible. Um, it was more than enough, more than I needed. But the problem was, is that the sentinels kept attacking me. It was absolutely hilarious. Almost got killed. Three, four, six. Oh, did I accidentally? That's what happened. I kept grabbing Gravitino balls. <laughs> How much do we have? Let's check real quick. 900. Let's just grab a few more. Hey, I'm walking here. Hey, let's grab you while we're here. Alright, back to the ship. Uh, ship, ship. Did I do it again? Did I lose my ship? This is hilarious. Yep, it's over there. Okay. Every episode, I lose my ship. That's what the P is in Paul. <laughs> family friendly, family friendly, family friendly. Yeah, 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 I know. Hey, buddy. Nice to see you. Don't attack me. Thank you. Okay, there we go. Is he? Seriously? Bye. <laughs> okay, guess what we're pulling in. If I can get it to work. You! Bunk. Let me get our one freighter with it. Frigate? Frigate. Alright, here we go. So we got our freighter in here. We have plenty of silver, plenty of fecium. We should have everything we need. Isn't it amazing that you don't have your hyperdrive fixed on your uh, on your freighter, but you can pull them in? Okay, here we go. So we need to make cultivation chambers. So we're going to do one, which gives us two plants. We need 18, so we need nine of these. Two, three, four, five, six... Seven, I'm just going to put them over there. Eight and nine. Okay, we're good. Let's make our frost wart, which is how many plants? 20 of them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. What's up, dude? Fourteen, sixteen. 17, 18, buddy. And that should do it. So even though we can build three more, my suggestion would be if you have the ability to build one more uh, of these things. Oh, I didn't. There you go. That's weird. I missed one somehow. That would have been a problem. Go ahead and build one more of these and give yourself two more just to play it safe because I've had occasion where one of the plants didn't grow for some stupid reason, and I don't know why. 
So there we go. So we got all of them done. Excellent. And they take one hour to build. So at the 238 mark, we will check them out. Okay. Okay. So let's go ahead and get our... We've got our reward. Which we'll get a bunch of decorative base parts, which we don't care to have. Expedition. So we're going to get that. You can see we're, we're still getting a lot of steps in here. So that's going to take a little bit more time. Um, we're going to move on to storm crystals. So we need to find a system that has storm crystals in it. Let's go ahead and select it for now. Um, and we should be able to find that. Uh, let's see. If I'm not mistaken, I think, let me check my notes. Rendezvous one. Good. And we can get that. I've got so many notes here. It's really ridiculous. There's my starter system. Yes, yes, yes. Wow. Really need to put these in better order. Rendezvous two, go to F bat. Hmm. Okay. You say so. Where's F bat? Alan, da -da, da -da -da, blah, and blah. FCAD, that's probably what I meant. Because we're at rendezvous two, correct? Yes, we are. Well, yes, yes, we are. Okay, let's get, get, get out there, check it out. Because it's right there. But we can't quite reach it from here. Oh, I gotta listen to that for a while. Okay, which planet is this again? Okay, and which planet is that? That is our foggy planet, which is how far away? One thirteen hundred. Where is F bat at? Because that makes me wonder why I put that down. New Malin? FCAD. That's where we needed to go. Oh, I know why. Yeah, it's out of our way. Well, let's go ahead and do it. If I remember correctly, this has the... See, it has activated copper on there. It's got Fecium, too, but the activated copper is what we're more interested in. Not that we need activated copper. What we're looking for is anytime you see an activated element on a planet, you have storm crystals. Usually. Not always. But it's a good chance that you probably do. All right. chugging right along. This is going to be one long video. I'm sorry. It's going to be under three hours at least, but, you know, hey. We've gotten a lot accomplished. We've gotten, I think, half of our milestones done at this point, right? We got 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. we got 16 of them. 16 out of 40. So, that's not terrible. We're about to complete some more. So, we need 7 storm crystals. Actually, you know what? If we choose that... Yeah, 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 whatever. Pretty sure this is the planet we're looking for. If we ever get there... Let's go ahead and recharge our launcher. Let's go ahead and recharge our pulse engine. There we go. And we're going to use these storm crystals to give us some warp hyper cores, and then we're all set. Um, that looks like water. I am going to head towards a landmass. Okay, we'll head over this way. Now, I don't think there's any storms going on, but what we're interested in is at least seeing if there is storm crystals here. All right. They're distinguishable. Ooh. Funky little plants here. We need to scan some more plants, so we are going to land. I don't see anything that looks like it. Oh, wait a minute. That storm crystal's right there. Okay. All right. Let's recharge ourselves. K-1 
Okay, we got cold char charging. Okay, we're good. We're good. So these are definitely storm crystals, as you can see. See? Natural curiosity. Well, if you say so. Also looking for something tall. 7.3 meters. That got it. Ha <laughs> ha! So we found them. Okay, so this was the planet to find them on. That's what I, I, well, that's the thing I was missing from it. Let's go ahead and get that. So we just got that one too. That is down here. Like we need a dream aerial. I'll scan some plants. I've got to scan plants. I'll scan you. Hi there. And we need water creatures too, so we're going to have to look for them. I have no idea how many plants we've discovered at this point. Let's check, shall we? What are you doing that for? Cut that out. I think that's down here, right? 22 of 26, so we need four more plants. That's a plant. And in actuality, if we do that, like you, we can scan these. One. We should be able to get some more. Oh, is that plant? Biological. Hi there. Pardon me. Coming through. You are not a plant. Oh, but well you are. Excellent. Okay. I'll go ahead and scan some animals too while we're at it. Once we get to the second rendezvous, we're going to get our nanite, uh, our nanite fix. That's what we'll call it. All right. Scan. Uh, we already got that. Do we have any oxygen plants nearby? Hazardous plants? Oh, there's one. Right there. I think we only need one more plant. Nope, that was it. That was it. Alright, good. Now we're just waiting on a storm. Excellent. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Alright, so that gets us this one. The more useless materials that we don't need. Alright, good. Good, good, good. Now we're just waiting on a storm. So we can gather stuff. So did we get, out of curiosity, an upgrade for our... No, we didn't. For our multi-tool. Nope. Okay. Just curious, because I wanted to know if we had our A-class upgrade yet. Okay. Alright, so we have those storm crystals right by my ship. Right? There's three of them right there. I'm not, I'm not mistaken, I think it's three. We need to... Yep, three. We need to find some more. We need four more. Whoa, look at that guy. That's 2.9 meters. Baloney. He's a little taller than that. Let's see what we got. Because it's a good idea. Because the, the storms here get really nasty, if I remember correctly. And they burn through it. Oh, that looks like there's a couple more over here. Gek word. Okay. Nope. Not going to worry about that. Alright, so how many is here? Two? Two more. Okay. Three. We got three here. Alright, so that's... Uh, hold on. I know this. Three over there. Three over here. So we need one more. Literally one more. I'd like to find it in unroute or ship. Over in this general direction, if we could. Hey, we got lucky. There they are. All right, good. So we're going to hang out here. Really? Interesting. 
I didn't know they were depleted. I could have swore it said 20%, but maybe that was a while ago. Uh, sorry. I think I pulled the Jason. Yeah, I said it. Shh, don't tell me. All right, good deal. Nice little oxygen patch. All right, so we know we have plenty in between. Wow, man, that's a big dude. It's like an albino one, too. Hey, that's what we're waiting on. So here we go. We'll get our storm crystals. We'll get our warp hyper cores, so we don't have to worry about the, you know, recharging our hyperdrive anymore. What's up, buddy? Watch the temperature. Any time now. Any time now. There it goes. Hottest temperature, huh? I remember one time I was on a planet, I think it was like 600 degrees. It was ridiculous. There we go. One, two, and three. Go to the next one. And because it's hot, we should be able to get all the way there. <laughs> one, two, and three. And last, but not least, right in front of us. Hey, little bonehead. Thanks. And we got it. All right, good deal. Excellent. So we're done with this one. So that's excellent. We got our we got our storm crystals. So in case you're wondering, now that we have it, we can go to our starship and we can actually create those. See, there's our warp hyper core. We still need antimatter, so we do have to make those. I'm gonna make three of them. That should be more than enough. How's our hyperdrive? It is empty. Not anymore. Beautiful. Let's get going. All right. Now, the, the, the dream aerial, my suggestion, because you're going to keep getting bugged by that, just go ahead and get rid of the thing. Honestly, just get rid of it. Where, where, where'd it go? Where'd it go? Is it on me? Is it in there? Where'd it go? There it is. It'll just bug the crap out of you, and there's no reason to keep your, your fireworks or your kelp. Uh, Gravitino balls were a complete accident. So, whoops, <laughs> to say the least. All right, so we're out of here. So we are going to head to our, whoa, I thought it was going to lock up on me, our rendezvous. It's up here. There you go. It's not very, it's not too far away, right? 3,000, 3,000 away. Yeah, it's going to take a little bit to get there. All right, so we're doing pretty good. We should be halfway through, I think, right? Uh, what do we get? Wonder projector plans. You know, I've got an idea. Yeah, I got me an idea. I got me an idea. Let's do this. Diversion. Let's head to our base. Go ahead and get this out of the way, because this will take care of our wonder projector. Hmm, very interesting. Kind of wish I had made it on the Paradise Planet now. Whatever. This just makes it <clears throat> again more interesting. And blam, blamo. Come on, get down there. You ruffian. Here we go. Oh, I missed one. What do you know? Oh, good. I can just come out of my ship right onto a plant that'll eat me. Do do do. Wonder projector. Where are you? There you are. And in case you're wondering, what you do is you go into your discoveries real quick. We don't have to do this. You don't, you yourself don't have to do this. Go into your catalog. Uh, and 
and look for wonders, things that you've discovered. I would go to fauna, look for something that looks pretty cool. Um, let's see. Let's do this guy. And what you can do is you see, you can register it. So let's go ahead and do that real quick. I forgot to do that. But what you can do too is, if it will let you do it here. That was weird. Let's try that again. Uh, wonders, right? Wanna. You can view the discovery, right? And you should be able to assign it something. Oh, unless it's doing it automatically. Let's find out. They may have fixed that. Hold on. And we got our 7,700 nanites now. See? Like I said, very easy to do. So it's not doing it. I don't know why. Hold on. I'm going to do it again. Wouldn't that be funny? Oh, wait a second. Maybe it's just you highlight it? No. Unless it won't let me do that one. That may be what it is. I bet you that's what it is. Hold on. Let's choose one of the others real quick here. Uh, like you. I know I'm missing it somehow. I'm supposed to be able to assign it here. All right, we're going to have to probably do this at another point. This is really, really weird. I thought this would work. I don't know why. Like the glitches, treasures. Hmm. Fascinating. Okay, maybe that's a glitch in the system, because you're supposed to be able to assign it to you, your wonders in here. So it doesn't seem to be working. But we got the achievement, so let's go ahead and claim it. Okay, which gives us our drives, which we've already got. We didn't have to get the drives. We could have gotten that later. Uh, there's our 500 Quicksilver that we don't really need. Uh, and what have we done? We've done one and two. We haven't ran... 8,000 yet, but we're going to do that on one of these other planets here very, very soon. So let's go to our second rendezvous and get some more running done. Hopefully we can get out of here without our buddy finding us. There we go. We're out of here. Hey, that worked. Good. All right. So we're on our way to our rendezvous. So this will give this this will give our second uh, phase pretty much completed, if I remember correctly. We'll have a couple other things to do, like the ancient site and the, the creature at the blood pH under uh, that amount, um, which we will get, I promise. All right, and I'm going through my notes again because I do have plenty of notes here. I even started making notes of the different planets I, I was visiting. So. All right. Looks like we're almost there. This one... I'm trying to remember what Rendezvous 2 was. So I know it wasn't an archive. Let's bring it in here. Was it a freighter? Slow down, slow down. I seem to recall it might have been a freighter. Plenty of places to land around here that have uh, landing pads. But I do not recall which one it was. Nope. Hold on a second. Just take a quick run around. 
I think we're going to have to land there anyway, whether we like it or not. But I know that wasn't it. And it was pretty far away, if I remember correctly. It was out this way someplace. Ah! Well, crap. Hmm. <laughs> Sorry. There we go. This, I guess it was an archive. There we go. Fascinating. No, you have nothing for me. Okay, so we're done there. See, we got our exploration on foot at 7,000. We really need to go another 1,000 to get what we're looking for. So we could do that now. Oh, that's a pretty cool looking ship, huh? Nice. I just broke my ankles. That's okay. Don't worry about it. Oh, and in order to explore on foot, let me show you something here real quick. Where'd it go? Over here. That. So, see how it's counting? If you jetpack, it stops counting. So, stay on your feet. Just walk around. That's all you have to do. I'll describe a word. Why not? We got three quarters of a thousand to go. 750 to go. So we'll go ahead and just go through. Go ahead and run. Get it done a little quicker. Might as well get it out of the way. I know I'm going to be running around on some other planets, but it's just one of those things I don't even want to think of it anymore. It's in the back of my mind. I'll keep thinking of it, and it's just going to annoy me. Ooh, can we get through there? Yes, we can. Yeah, let's get our steps in. That's what we're doing. We're getting our steps in. That reminds me, i got to get my steps in, too. I'm going to have to go for a walk after this myself. Try to get about 10,000 a day. There we go. Let's go back down here. And we're going to make a right. Let's go up the other stairwell. This is hilarious. And you can't use your jetpack. That's what sucks about all this. Can we, can we run in place? Nope. Wondered about that. That would have been funny. You could have just stood there and, you know, went up against the guardrail and just started running. But doesn't want you to do that. All right, we got less than 200. We're just going to run the sh run around the ship now. Oh, there he is again. I'm just curious. What is this? Agabu of Frost. An interesting looking ship. I don't particularly care for the wing design. I never liked that. Front nose. I do like those. All right. Here we go. Almost there. 60, 50, 40, 30, uh, 20, 10, and there we go. Got it. Let's grab it. So that means that Expedition 1 is complete. Done. Now it's funny because it takes a while to get done with Expedition 1. So we're going to go ahead and get our rewards. Okay, stop it, stop it, stop it. Expedition 2 is now complete, which we get our nanites. And we're going to go ahead and upgrade here, going down. And I think that's a supercharged slot right there. Okay, let's go ahead and grab our rewards. Advanced mining laser, let's go ahead and put it in. About time we got that, right? That's our you know, jetpack. We'll put that up there. Yeah, we didn't get it. What do you know? Okay, that's okay. And we get all these nice uh, charts. We're going to need those later. But there is something nearby, if I remember correctly. Rendezvous 2. I've got a note on this. Hold on, hold on. I should probably go into the other menu. Go in this menu. Oh, I think... Can we do this now? No? No, it won't let us do it. Okay, let's go back to the expedition. Um, we got to get our blood pH guy. So what do we got? We got 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 
1819, and 23. So 23 of them. We still got to get our Corvax words in. Got to get the Paradise World, which we'll get. Rendezvous 2. I thought I had a note on it that described the fact that there was something nearby. Oh, there was an obelisk near Rendezvous 1. That would have got us what we were looking for. Okay, so we can do it here. I just like to be in my ship when I do this. Um, back to you. What do we got? We want none of those. We want this. Let's see what it finds. Alien, alien artifact detected. I think that's what we're looking for. Let's do the other one, too, while we're at it. The monolith. That's the one we needed. The monolith. Which should be this one. It says ancient plaque. What about you? What are you? Monolith. Oh, this is the one that's close by. Maybe it was our rendezvous, too. Yep, this is it. Okay, sorry about that. And we are in the middle of a storm. Now this is a Gex system, so getting the words aren't really going to help us out any. Let's just go around the other side of that. Here we go. Okay. Yep. I know this one. Kill the creature. And you're rewarded for it. And then the other thing you can do is go into here. And you can give that Gek relic back to them, and they'll give you your, your portal. So... You can use that portal later on if you want. Now, the ancient plaque one is also a good one to go to. So this system has our world in it, if you will, as our base. So we can come back here and use that portal and go to the other one. All right. So this is the ancient plaque. Let's go to that one. That's going to get us our ancient treasure that we need to get. There we go. Someone set up a base right next to it? No. Okay, good. All right. So we're going to get our... So we get about 30 minutes, right? Yeah. A little over 30 minutes to get some more of these things done. Ah, yeah. Not exactly what I'm looking for. And knowledge of the past is what we're looking for, not help with language. So this is going to get us our treasure. All right, good deal. We got a portal ready for us, and we got this. Excellent. How's our launch thruster doing? Doing, doing good, doing good. Uh, a little over a minute. We're going to go up a little higher and then hit it. Whoa. Okay. Hi there. Uh, yeah. No kidding. Oh, you're just a pain in the neck. Okay. We'll just go up high. And then come back down. Ugh. Almost dizzying, right? And I think with the tall mountains around us, if we had we not had our... Achievement for the 625 meters over the sea, we would have had it here. And boom. Now, in case you all don't know the way to do this, uh, frame manipulator. Look for this arch here. Carve down. It's a pathway that leads to your first key. There it is. One. We'll come back here in a moment. Second one is inside here. There's a bunch of others, but these are the easiest three to get to. So there's two. And do the same thing over here. Goes down and to the right. And here's your third key. All three keys, you're done. 
Don't grab grab the Grappuccino ball unless you want to start some trouble. And you remember where you started over here? See this archway? Just go down here. And there's your large artifact crate. One, two, and three. And you'll get your treasure, which is always a rare item. And there you go. You're done. So that one's done too. So let's go back to our expedition. And we're going to choose... Collect the reward. All that glitters. Which gets you a optical drill. Um, get you your three passes. Keep the third one if you want. But get rid of the other two. They're not necessary. Uh, these things you really don't need anymore. Uh, you can hang on to them if you want. But here's the thing that's going to get you some cash. So you might want to hang on to that. All right, good. So we're all done there. Now what we can do, too, I went ahead and wrote down a um, coordinates. Let's see what we have left. We have a lot left, but let's see what we have left. Uh, let's see. You've got the pH, which is where we can go to get that. We've got the third rendezvous, which is, I think, where we're going to be going. Harvest plants, which we're waiting on. Body temperature, yes, we're going to be getting that later. Visiting a red star. Okay. So we have to visit some stars as well. So let's use the portal. Let's get that taken care of. Okay, and if I'm not mistaken, none of the planets in our system are special. Nope. Okay, good. Let's go to the portal. Oh, that hurt. Right into it. That was great. I'm sorry, I was texting at the time. I shouldn't have been texting. No, it's just terrible. Up and out. And we're going to go to that portal now. Yeah, somebody built the base there. Now, another reason to have all of these things in your inventory, as far as getting as many minerals and stuff like that is concerned, you got to break open the uh, portal. you got to fix all the technology on it before you can actually use it. Now, as with any of these, do not use the landing pads for your speed runs that are built by other people, that is. All right. Uh, we got plenty of dihydrogen, so we're going to use that. And we do have enough emerald to get by. So glad I did not use that. Uh, let's go carbon. So I can always get more of it. I'm going to go ahead and do the emerald here right now, just so I know I have it. Uh, you. Ah. There we go. Okay, so like I said, I have an address written down. This is from Scottish Rod. I'm going to activate the portal. And the address is as follows. Burb. Burb. I say it, I say it funny. Purposely. Balloon. Dragonfly. Over here. Triforce. As I call it. Whale. Balloon, the weird face, the TP, where's the TP, there it is, uh, the moon, dragonfly, and moon. And here we go. I always have to jump just before you go in. I think it looks pretty neat. Like he's really just giving himself over to it. Now yeah, these portals are loud, huh? Get my cat back on this stupid thing. There we go. So that's our portal travel. To an ugly, ugly planet. And we got a hostile world. Excellent, excellent, excellent. 
So that should get us... Hold on. Here. There we go. Hostility. And we've gone through a portal. Oh, I hate when it keeps doing that. It keeps going to the same thing over and over again. There it is. Okay, we got our portal. Okay, good, good, good. Let's get up here. We get one of these. Let's go ahead and put it in there. Um, what's this? Launch auto thruster. Yes, we're going to auto charge unit. And two hyperdrives. We have no room for at all. Okay. Well, you know they're going to be better than these. So let's get rid of that one. There we go. That's nice. 227. This one was only 100 light years, so we'll go ahead and get rid of that one. We'll put this one in. And we're at 700. There we go. That's very nice. All right, good. Oh, personal refiner. I forgot I even had that. We'll go ahead and put that in here, and we're going to go ahead and get rid of you. We don't need you anymore. Okay, good. And we got these, and I don't know why. It's probably, if we could turn them into uh, nanites if you were really hurting for them, but honestly, that's interesting. I'm just curious at how many you got out of it. Uh, we're going to go ahead and fully charge it. 250? All right. Which is interesting, because if you get 250 from each of the anomalous planets, which is six of them, you get 100, you get 1,500 nanites from that. Plus the 6,000 they give you, and plus this, that gives you 7,750. So you don't need to discover all the animals on any particular one planet. Isn't that interesting? They give it to you. It's all there. So, needless to say. All right. Indeed. Thank you, Scottish Rod. Appreciate it. So we get through here. So where are we, indeed? Let's find out. So we needed to go to... Rendezvous 3, because rend this is almost done. We just need the pH level. Um, is that here? I don't know if it's here or not. I don't think it is. Hey, what do you know? They got storm crystals here too, huh? Let's just check. Shall we? That's plants. Okay. I don't think so, because this is not... It's damp. It's not toxic. So, yeah, let's go ahead and get out of here. I don't think this is the planet we're looking for. We'll go ahead and exit this place. Because we could go back through. Hold on a second here. Let's check something. Okay, so this is the system that we're at. And I'm pretty certain we should go back through. Let's see what happens here. I'm curious. Yeah, we are nowhere near where we need to be. So we need to go back through. Okay, let's head back down. Yeah, we got to Angry kitty in the background who wants to get out of the place. He's our outdoor cat who tends to uh, take care of all the mice in the area. So yeah, we're going to hit this portal again. So this was a waste of our time to just... It wasn't a waste of time. We did need a hostile world. And if we needed the storm crystals, we could have stayed here and gotten the storm crystals. There we go. So that'll take care of that. So I think we're up to about between 25 and 30 of the milestones at this point taken care of. 
So we've got probably about 10 to 12 to go. I think about 12, 12, 13, something like that. And some of them are going to be fairly easy. Okay, we're back. Where's my ship? Classic statement from me. Where is my ship? Okay, let's go. Up, 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 let's go. Alright. So, what we're going to do is we're going to go into our galaxy map, and we're going to... We're going to take the, the, the usual route. We need to go all the way out there to get to uh, Rendezvous 3, which you can see in the distance. But we also need to do a red star and a blue star and a green star. So let's do the red star first. Let's get one real close by. Yeah, let's do this one. There's no worlds there, so we shouldn't get into, into any battles. No space station, I should say. It's uninhabited, so it should just, you know, pop in. We'll leave. Done. Watch it be discovered by somebody, though. Yeah, go figure. Icy planet. We got the red star. And there was only two planets, I think, right? Yeah, the other one should be close by. Where's the other one at? There it is. And parched. Okay. Next. Okay. We're going to hit a... Let's see, there was a red one on the way. Look at that. So let's go hit a blue star. This one looks good. And then we're going to hit a green one, and we should be done with those three milestones real quick. Looking at the time, we got about 20 minutes, less than 20 minutes. So the plants are done. Okay. Wow. The redacted planet. Now remember, we're also looking for those strange worlds that we can land on. So let's make sure that we check the planets here. Scaly, we got one. Also redacted. Seven animals. Twelve. We got underwater there. We got to get some underwater planets to uh, plant. Underwater animals as well. Okay. So let's go to the scaly planet, and then we can hit that one real quick. Well, let's go to scaly, because we need to get our... Yep, see? One. That's where we want to do. Okay, good. Let's see if I can find that. Is that that one? No. There is a planet behind it. Let's go back the other way. You. Scaly. This is the one. Big for vortex cubes? No, thank you. Okay, real quick, let's go ahead and get our rewards. Anomaly detector, supreme launch thrusters upgrade, and a portable reactor. We can't do anything with those. And... No autolon chamber, because we need to go down and we need to find a other one. So we can do that here. We need three more metal plates. Okay. See, whenever you get to these hexagonal... Hexagonal uh, looking planet surfaces from a distance, you know you got the right place for an anomalous creature. It's where we need to go. Oh, easy, 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 easy. Whoa. Yikes. Okay. Uh, open spot. Open spot. Open spot. That looks like an open spot. We'll go down here. All right. What do we got? And done. Off we go. Launch thrusters could use some help. Okay. So the planet we're looking for this time is... Revec. 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 Something like that. That's it. Right in front of me. Straight ahead. My Sentinel activity, which we're not worried about. So we're going to find our underwater treasure this time. Real quick, let's check check it off. Eight. Not quite 16. we got 17. 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. 
23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. So we got 10 to go. In about 15 minutes. Let's see what we can do, right? Uh, let's go to the edge over there because we just got a bunch of ships in my way. Alright, there we go. That looks like a spot. We'll go down there. We need three more metal plates. Alright. Let's put them on me. Uh, we need... Where are they? There we go. One, two, three. Starship. Because uh, we can't rely on them to be here. Where are the... There you go. We'll need both of those. Hmm. Interesting. I'll take that. I don't know what that was doing there. Okay. Not on chamber. This has to be underwater. Which for some reason it doesn't think... Oh, that'll work. No, my, my suggestion would be to... If you think you're going to need it later, get rid of it. Now, one thing we have to do is we have to install some stuff on the ship. Which is... That's launch thrusters. Hold on, we got to see we have Humboldt Drive, which we don't really need. But let me just check the Exocraft real quick. Oh yeah, there it is. Right there. A hyper sonar. You need a solar mirror for it, so let's build a solar mirror. Which we should have... The recipe for it. We need gold. Of course we need gold. So that's why you wanted to keep the gold. Yeah. I need 40 gold. Unbelievable. Um, hold on a second. Hold the phone. Can I... Do they give you gold or silver? I think these give you silver. No, they do give you gold. There we go. I'm thinking. Using my brain. Okay, let's install it. Back to the Exocraft. So we got to install the sonar. And we need the solar mirror. There you are. Done. Okay. And what we need to do is get on board. We want to use the X, use our sonar. We're going to look for submerged ruins. Ruins detected. Wait for it to show up. There it is. And it's over there. About 11 minutes away, swimming. That's not what we're going to do. There we go. We're going to fly there. And you notice we picked up our... base that the Nautilon sits on. So that way, if we do have to bring it in and actually charge it and all that crap, we can use it. But we're prob we shouldn't have to. Alright, good. Looks like we have something... Should be out there. I want to see if there's a closer land mass. There isn't. Okay, so we're going to have to do a little bit of swimming. Yeah. This one will do fine. Okay, and it's a hot storm, which is good. We should go a lot longer. Through the air. There we go. That was good. That was a good run. And down we go. And while we're waiting, uh, let's see that. Let's charge it back up. And as long as you have one extra pearl, you should be able to get this done pretty quick. And I'm not going to bother reading anything. We're just going to go ahead and go through it all. Okay, and we got our key. And then look down below, and you should see right below us. There's one. We'll take that one.
and you need the pearl and the key that you just got. And there you go. And where is my ship? I'm doing it again, aren't I? Right this way. Okay. There we go. So that's done. Creepy looking creatures under here. I don't know what else to say. This may take just a little bit to get where we're going. Oh, we gotta we gotta discover the underwater creatures. I forgot about that. Where are you? Get back here. Biological entity. One. There we go. That. Ah. Those are some underwater creatures I could have discovered. There we go. A lot of good creatures on this planet. Good. Excellent. I don't think there's any others, but I think we might have got it. Did we get it? No? Let's check real quick. How many do we have to get? I need two more. So we're going to have to find two more creatures that we can discover. And I don't think there's any on this planet. Let me see. Ground, 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 ground. Flying into underground. Okay, so no, we're done. I don't know why it goes there. It goes to my mining laser. And it's like, hey, your mining laser's running low. Um, no, it's not. What's up with that? Ugh. Log, slog, drag. Takes forever. I know, what can I say? There we go. All right. We're back. So, that completes out that one. Okay. Anything else we need? Let's get rid of that. Uh, let's see. No, 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 no. Okay. So, let's go back. Wow. That's, uh, that's something, huh? Got all kinds of garbage in my inventory. So we need to still get a creature with a blood pH. So we're going to have to look for those planets real soon. Uh, we need to get the plants in about 5 or 10 more minutes. We need to record a body temperature over 140 for a hot planet. I think that might have been the planet I was at, but we'll see. So we may have some more work to do. Okay. Let's check out these planets real quick. Scaly, which we already landed at. There. No. No. And no. Flame ruptured. It's a hot planet. Might have what we're looking for. Let's go to our next system. We need red. We need a green planet next. Which is one right there. So we'll check out this planet, which is close to our rendezvous number three. And now we can get that achievement, we'll be done. All right. Any time now. There we go. No battles. Oh, we got a we got a water planet here too. Okay, so what do we got? Let's take a look. So we have the hyper hyperborean planet, sharded. That'll be our last planet, Bont. Okay, good. 
Doomed Jade. Fascinating. Breached. Hmm. So we can go to either one of those. Font A12 or Keygrove. Corrosive. And there's our third planet. So we can go to all three of these. Any, any one of these two and this one, and that'll get us what we need. Okay. Where to? What are you? That's our Hyperborean. Let's head there. Let's get our two creatures knocked out. There's another planet beyond it. Let's see what that one looks like. Hold on. I think that's this one. So, we'll see. Because we need a creature that's hot as well. And this one looks like it's already got a storm going on, hence the reason why we can't see the water anymore. Yeah, we want to go a little bit north of there. Go a little bit up this way. There we go. Just any landmass we can land on. Jump under the water. Take a look. Down we go. Into the abyss. Whoa, okay. Hang on. I thought we were ever... Water. What happened here? This doesn't have as much water as I thought it did. Let's turn around and take a peek. No? Not really helping us much, is it? There we go. That looks a little better. Unless that's all land. Pretty sure it's water, though. It is water. Okay, good. Boom, 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 boom. I love that. You look just dandy for me. Oh, look at that. Hmm. Go figure. Okay, show up. There's one. Need one more. And if you tell me there's only one animal underwater on this planet, I'm going to get very upset. How come I get the feeling that's what it's going to turn out to be? Ground, 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 flying, flying. Two more underwater. Okay, we should have two more. We only need one. Oh, you're going to give me trouble, aren't you? Unbelievable. The only time I need the second of the three animals to show up. There we go. There we go. Got it. All right. We got it. Ten aquatic creatures. Okay. So let's take that. That's done. Okay. Yeah, I don't need those. I got a bunch of oxygen out of it, too. That's handy. Okay, stop. Back to one. Alright, so what's our next planet? What are you? Doomed Jade. Was that one of them? I don't think it was. No. So it's either Keygrove or Font A12. Font A12 has rings. There it is. Corrosive Blood Portal. That's sharded. And what about this one? Toxic. 23, 23. All right, let's head out there because we've got to get to those two planets. So we'll hit both of them at the same, well, not at the same time, but, you know, we'll, we'll hit one and hit the other. And we're coming up on our one hour mark for our plants. So I think we did pretty good. Eight. We're still missing that one, which we're going to get here. 
So 15, 20, 26, 30. So we've got 30 of them. Yeah. We still need Corvax wor uh, words. Um, this system is a Corvax? No. It's a Gek. Okay. Well, we'll get that at Rendezvous 3. And we still have to hit 4 and 5 after that, so... We'll do it. And hopefully this will just be... We'll end this video at the th around the 3 hour mark. We still have 20 minutes for that. And I think we'll have everything done. Mostly. Alright, how am I... Oh, yeah, it's getting a little low, isn't it? Monster thrusters, let's go ahead and get you charged. Pulse engine, get you charged. What else? Yeah, the rest of you are fine. I don't need you. And goodbye. There it is. So the other one's just on the other side of this one, so that's good. You know what I might do? Let's do something here. go over here first, and then we'll come back. So let's get our corrosive animal, which by the way, that is all fixed and has been for a little while now. Um, let's go down to a lower plane because animals will be better down there. down there. No? Okay. We'll just land. Oh, what do you know? I'll take it. Free landing. Reminds me of another planet from another expedition. Alright. What do we got? You! Hopefully you won't eat me. Dangerous with toxic meat. And there it is. Done! Moving on. Goodbye. That was quick. So we're going to head to this planet next. Not bad. Let's go ahead and collect it. That completes out phase two. Down we go. You get so much stuff handed to you. Looks like we have ourselves a spot. Possibly. No. No. It's uh, abandoned. Okay. We just need one more creature. Any around me. No. How far away are you? Yeah, I'm gonna go s deprive myself of oxygen again, thanks. There it is. Got him. And there you go. That one's done. Um, I'm trying to get my life support going. Thank you. Okay. So we're done with that. All right. Excellent. So, killed three things in this system. So, what do we have left? Thirty glitches. Great. I am actually not that amused by that. So, one is done. Two is done. Three. We got to get to the third. We need to harvest our plants. Let's do that over there. We still need to discover a creature with a hot temperature over 140. Don't we have a, a world here that has that? Parched, toxic, doomed, breached, shorted. No, no, it's not here. Okay, let's go on. And on our way. And we'll pull in our freighter and we'll gather up all the plants real quick. We're going to have to delete some stuff from our inventory because we're just going to be overflowing with garbage that we don't need. 
Now, if you wanted to keep this save as your normal save, then by all means find a way to store it in your trader or something along those lines in order to keep it as much as possible. There we go. Okay, and there is our spot that we need to go. So let's go there. Now, the thing is, we haven't discovered the... I was just going to say the Eternal Garden. Never mind. Done. It's funny how that works. And that was in Phase 5, even though we're hitting it on Phase 3. Go figure. So we're going to be pulling in our freighter soon. As soon as we land, we'll pull the freighter in overhead. And it's a portal. Keep that in mind. We've already done the portal travel, so we don't have to do any of that yet. We do have to hit a black hole later on, but we can do that when we hit Nada. Not bad. Not bad. I think we're going to hit this. Is it on the other planet? Ugh. Ah. Uh. <laughs> we still locked in on it? Looks like we are. And plus there was water on this planet, so we could have discovered our last couple creatures here if we wanted to. But it is what it is. It's okay. We're good. Down we go. There we go. Now, I'm recording this on a Saturday night. I'm probably going to release it on Sunday morning. Maybe later on tonight. I don't know yet. Alright. Where be the portal? Because we're approaching from a very strange direction. What in the world? Holy mackerel. Hey, give him credit. That was pretty ingenious. But I do not see the portal. And the portal, I thought, had a whole bunch of... Uh... Yeah, look at that. Hmm. Had a whole bunch of... Communication... Oh, there it is. Right here. Here we go. And we're done. Good. Okay, so we got to rendezvous three. Just got to get closer. There it is. And we're done with that. So rendezvous three is done. We're going to get that. We get 1,200 more nanites. Um, yeah, why not? That's fine. Okay, we don't need these. I'm going to get rid of these. Uh, yeah, I guess. I'll just stick it up here because I have nowhere else to put it right now. What do we have in the starship? Is it full? It's pretty much full. Humboldt Drive, we don't need those. Launch thrusters module would be great, but we don't have any room in our ship. Uh, what are you? Shield module, which is for exosuit. Yes, we'll go ahead and put it in. Uh, I don't even know where I go with linking, if anything, but that's okay. It's there. It gives us more health. Uh, what do we have? So we got glitches. Let's get rid of the glitches. We don't need those. Or the food. Glitch. Glitch. Got some chromatic metal in here. Did we use up the chromatic metal we had? No, no, we got tons of it. Okay. So, yeah, I'm wasting a little time here. I just want to get these taken care of. Do I need this? No, I don't. Okay, we'll just put you guys down here. Alright, we don't need you. I'll hang on to you in case I decide I want to use you. Got plenty of emerald. Okay. And our inventory here is getting ridiculous as well. But that's okay. Actually, I've got a place for you. There. Okay. That looks good. Alright. We're alright. I don't think we need the dirt. Is the dirt worth anything? Bye. Yeah. We don't need that. Uranium can go in this ship. Alright. We're good. So, where were we? Um... Let's check out our... We've got to harvest our plants. So let's go ahead and call in the freighter. Boom. Okay, we'll be doing that next. And we've got to record a body temperature over a very great amount. <clears throat> which I don't think is going to be here. I'm pretty certain that the creatures here... I want to think there was an aggressive creature here, if I remember correctly. I 
And I, I know we don't need the aggressive creature, but it was here. If I remember rightly. Unless it was a different creature I'm thinking of. Let's see if this one's the one I'm thinking of. No. And I don't think it was aggressive. I thought it was a different type of creature. Maybe not. Maybe not. I could be mistaken. Because we need a hot-blooded creature, and I don't remember if this was the world we got it from or not. All right, let's go to our ship. Nice to have those jetpacks working, right? Let's check over here. What do we got? We've got a paradise planet, we've got a metallic planet, and we've got a toxic planet. So we don't really have any planets that was going to help us out here. So let's go ahead and get out of here. And head up to the freighter. Where'd it go? There it is. Oh, it's even loud for me. All right, we'll harvest our plants. There we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stop saluting. Okay, start over here. One, two, three, four... Just go down to the bottom and it harvests, harvests them all in twos. There it is. You got them. Harvested 18 plants. Where did it put them? Hopefully not in my own inventory, right? No? Good. I'm just going to grab a little extra carbon while I'm here. Okay. All right, so that takes care of that. Uh, let's get to the expedition. There we go. We haven't gotten that yet. Okay, so expedition three is just about complete. So what do we got? We got one more for the temperature of 140. We've got to reach rendezvous four, go through a black hole... Corvax and final rendezvous. Okay, so next Corvax system, we should stop at the space station. And then we're done. Let's do this. Okay. Here we go. Expedition route? It's not showing me where the fourth expedition is, is it? And it's only 334. I can go 700 light years. I wonder why it's not doing that. All right. Is this a Corvac system? It is. Let's go ahead and hit it. We'll just hit the space station. Now, we've got to have a space battle sooner or later, so we've got to keep our, our eyes open. And as long as it's not one of the big, big, huge Dreadnought battles, we should be able to get out of it pretty quickly. If what I try to do still works. Okay. Paradise Planet. What do you know? Space Station. Wow, we really came out far from the Space Station. I've never seen that before. Usually you come out right next to it. While we're going in, check out our planets. Gamma, Paradise, Humid, and Shellstrom. Nope, not going to help us. So we're just going to talk to these guys. I need six of them. You're first. Oh, for crying out loud. Really? First guy I hit, huh?
And it's a, I just realized I'm, I'm talking to a Viking as I'm trying to think of whether I could have had hired the guy and got out of it quicker. Alright, so that's one. We need six. Two. Three. Gosh, are we going to have enough people here? Four. There's two more over there, I think. Yes, yes there is. This is five. Come on. Talk, talk, talk. And six. Done. There it is. That's done. Next system. Didn't know you could do that, did you? Go into hyperspace while you're inside the space station. Can we get all the way there? Out of jump range. Just out of jump range. There it is. All right, let's see what we can get. I'm hoping for the best here. We need a hot planet. No choice in the matter. A very hot planet with very hot-blooded creatures, and we can get our hot-blooded milestone. In the next five minutes. That yeah, went there pretty quick. Paradise, Verdant, Tectonic, and Frozen. Moving on. Should get us to our rendezvous four. Let's make over a little. Just a little bit. I mean, I was hoping to get this done in like two and a half hours, but as far as the timer is concerned, about two and a half hours, but you know, a little over three, it's not terrible. Oh, wait, wait, is this what I think it is? Nope, it isn't. Good. Okay, we're good. Okay, what do we got? We've got rice again. Bountiful, desert, and rainy. We do not have what we're looking for here. But we have to hit our fourth rendezvous, so let's do it. Got to be one of the furthest planets away. I think they do it purposely. All right. So yeah, this is going to go over the three hour mark. Sorry about that, but hope you've enjoyed it so far. Almost like watching me live, but it's... It's a dead stream. That's what we call it. So you notice I've never paused it. I've never... You haven't seen any transitions. You're not seeing me do anything special here, so... And as you can see, it's even getting darker and darker in here. Let's go ahead and adjust our lighting, shall we? Okay, we're going to turn on the lamp. There we go. A little more light. There we go. That looks better. Did I miss it completely? Yeah, close enough. This one, I want to say, was a freighter? I think it was. That was a base. Can't see a th blessed thing. Is this it? I think this is it. There's our landing pad. And if you're hurting for money, you can raid the cargo chests here, but at this point, you shouldn't be hurting for money. Hello. Thank you. All right. Let's go ahead and grab that. Rendezvous 4 is done. Yeah, we'll just put it down there. Superheated. Now, I don't think there's any hot creatures here. 
but with no harm in checking, as they say. I don't quite recall. You know what? I do recall. I think I recall them being here and saying, yeah, you know what? There were some hot creatures here. But I don't remember if I wrote it down or not. Oh, I know where it might be. It might be in that... Uh, Mine. Yep. Let's just get a little away from the freighter. I think that's what we had to do. No, that wasn't it. Biological entity. No. I think what it was is it was a hot planet. And it wasn't this one. If I remember correctly. Yeah. I don't think it's here. Pretty sure it's not. Actually. Yeah. Let's go ahead and get going. I don't think I think we're wasting our time. Okay, see, so not, not applicable. This is definitely not the world I need to be on. Okay, good. We're out of here. On to number five. Okay. We're out of here. Okay. So like I said, this, this system didn't have a hot world on it. So we're going to go back to the expedition. We're going to go on to phase five. The only thing we have left, really, is the hot-blooded creature... Black hole. We learn the words and we get that out of the way. Okay. And rendezvous five. And that's it. We got three milestones to go. So let's go ahead and head out into the wild yonder. Wild blue yonder. Black yonder. I don't know what you want to call it here. Okay. And I'm not just going to try looking for a system that we can get to. So let me see. So can we get to the system on our own? Nope. A little too far. So we'll go here. Hmm. Play God 12. I seem to recall that that's a good, good system. I actually have a notebook around here somewhere that's got some notes in it for this. But I have no idea what in the world I did with it. it. should be right here. No, it is right here. Just not the notebook I was looking for. Well... That I had in my mind. All right. Little trick. This somehow works every time. Go to the front la flat front ship, because you can still go very fast for some reason, and head towards the, the bay. And... Gone. I don't know why that works, but it does. Every single time. No high temperature worlds detected in current system, so let's just keep going. It's the last thing we need to do, so we're just going to keep going. There we go. Go to this system, which is our Rendezvous 5. Speed run, sort of, like I said, more like speed research run. I think that's what Delta One was doing the other day. He did a research run to check it out, but he was very concerned about the wrong things, and I think once he gone through it, he realizes what he's really been looking for. Okay, it's not saying there isn't a planet like that here. So, Paradise, Scorched, there you go. Frozen, Bountiful, and Flourishing. So we want to go to the Scorched Watch your step planet, Itlib Kizaw. It has rings, so that's the one we need to go to. There we go. So let's head there. Watch your step. That was pretty good. I appreciate a good pun. And once we've hit this planet, we'll hit rendezvous five. Then we'll pull in the anomaly. We'll ask Nada for a black hole address, and we'll be done few more moments. 
Now hopefully we can find a creature on this planet, otherwise we're going to be searching a little bit further. Okay, just bring it down. I'm not looking for anything anymore. Hyperdrive, eh, not worried about it. Out we go. Look for creatures. Come on now. Where's me creatures? Sometimes they're flying creatures on these planets. Fauna. Hi. Says there should be a lot of creatures on this planet. Oh, there's one. Okay. It's not giving me any temperature reading on that guy. Okay. Interesting plant. I'm still not seeing any creatures. Is it because of the storm? Get a little ways away. Maybe we'll go ahead and grab some condensed carbon while we're here. I really would have thought... Oh, wait. Because the storm is over, so maybe the creatures will start coming out? There's my ship. Didn't lose it. Okay. Okay, this is really, really odd. Uh, we're not getting any creatures to show up. Except for the one that's flying. Let's see what we got. Hold on. Flying, 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 and one underground. So there's literally only one underground creature here. So we need a cave. So if the creature that we're looking for is underground, then again, we need to find a cave. And usually the easiest way to find a cave is if you can find some place to land. Like some kind of a, a campsite or a small trading outpost or something like that. They always have usually a cave nearby. There's something. How far away are you? Why isn't it giving me an... an, an a, that's strange. 35 seconds. That's going to be a landing platform. Something that far out is almost always a landing platform. I was kind of hoping for something a little smaller, because sometimes landing platforms don't have caves. Like that. Nope, that's not what I'm looking for. Man, those plants are big. <laughs> All right, let's take a look. I'm not seeing anything yet. Looks like there's a possible cave over there. Sack venom. Ah. My ancient enemy of all of my permadeath deaths is sack venom. Stay away from them if you can. Wow. I really would have expected a lot more from this planet. I really thought we'd find something here, but this is getting annoying. 
Well, definitely a cave. It would be nice if we found a creature in it. Like, immediately, rather than waiting. But I don't think this cave's big enough to house a creature in it, so... We're probably not going to find what we're looking for here. Oh, hello. Trying to get out of the cave. There we go. Okay, that was really weird. Yeah, we could have something else over here. No, no. It's not what we're looking for. And I see no other flying creatures, but the one creature I've discovered. So this may this system's not gonna work for us. Not gonna work. I'm sure if we could find a cave and we could go inside and everything like that, it would work. But obviously it's just not happening. So let's go to our ship. Let's go to Rendezvous 5. And we'll see if we can't find a system nearby that has a hot planet on it. And we'll give it, I don't know, 15 extra minutes tops. Let's make sure we get it selected. There you go. Sure, there's a lot of communication beacons. Interesting. Fortunately, this planet isn't too far out, so let's go ahead and recharge our pulse engine. We'll use the pyrite this time. Well, why did I buy it otherwise, right? Okay, good. So this will complete this one. We can go through a black hole still, but we still need to find ourselves... Oh, it's not there. It's at the other place. There we go. On the moon. That's fine. Kind of a small place, so we should find what we're looking for pretty quick. I don't think it's there. And here's the other problem. is trying to find the place that you need to land. Let's just go ahead and land. I'll look for it the hard way. That way. That is hilarious. Easy prey, huh? How big are you? Interesting. Oh, and he's attack attacking me. Isn't that interesting? Oh, there it is. Found it. Hi, buddy. Oh, you too, huh? Another archive. Here we go. Okay. Let's get our fifth rendezvous. Done. Okay, so final rendezvous completed. We only need to go through a black hole and get a hot animal. Go ahead and do it. Not that it really makes a difference at this point. Hey, what do you know? Supercharged slot. Okay. And then let's get the the other award. Reward. Award. Okay. So now we need to go back to four and get our black hole. Let's go ahead and do that. We'll call in the anomaly and then we'll go look for the hot creature. Off we go. And this should be it. I 
I just seem to think that I've missed something along the way. That I've missed a creature somewhere on some planet someplace. And I don't know which one it was. I'm thinking it's the planet that we went to that was the most hostile planet that we teleported to for Scottish Rod, and that planet also had the hottest creature on it. Can't quite remember. Polo. Uh, black hole coordinates. Good deal. Back down we go. So we'll go through the black hole, and then we'll find a planet that we can go to that's hopefully hot. And we have to get it far enough away from, this, from the anomaly to, to pull it in. There we go. It'll have to say alert. There it is. Where are you? There you are. Good deal. Whoa, dude. Okay, so we want to go all the way up there. Uh, right there. Okay, that's a dissonant system. Go figure. Hmm. Now, of course, before we go through the black hole, we're going to check the system out real quick, make sure there's no hot, scorching planets there that we can stop in. There's the black hole. Okay, let's check. What do we got? Overgrown, supercritical, empty, metallurgic, and contaminated. Not going to help me. To the black hole we go. I love the special effects on this. You get this, the, the, the duplicate image type thing. It's kind of crazy. Uh, I think that's pretty cool. So we've gone through a black hole. Which you want to wait until you do after Rendezvous 5. Because otherwise you're thrown eight, you know, a million light years away and you won't have any idea how to get back. You'll have to try to find another black hole to get back. Or a portal. You'll have to probably go through a portal. Oh, this is an interesting world. Okay. like someone's been here. 1.3 million, huh? What, what does it say? Interesting. Looks like we might have another planet here. Hold on. Boiling. I think that's it. Grassy. Imo. That's cold. Paradise. Yes, of course. Flourishing and calcified. So we need to go to Obichus. Okay. It's a reddish planet. Let's take a look around. Oh, that might be it. It is. Off we go. So we got the event horizon one. Let's go ahead and grab it. So phase four is now complete. And that's complete. Okay. So the only thing we have left is that. Just that. We've got all the others done. That's it. Last one. So honestly, I'm kind of surprised at how fast I did get it done. Though still three, three hours and fifteen, sixteen minutes, it's kind of, kind of a long time. So I'm thinking that the actual time is about two and a half right now. Aggressive Sentinels. This is going to be fun. Uh, is that someplace I can land? Don't know. Uh, there we go. Okay. So that's a campsite, is all that is, which we could use. That's just another campsite, which we could use as well. But I'd rather have something with a building I can go inside. That one behind me will probably have to do. So let's go ahead and hit it. Is it right here? Yeah, there it is. Interesting looking planet, though. Almost liking it. This looks like a good spot to stop.
Well, we already got creatures. One. And two. Wait. No. One eleven. Okay, we're getting there. There's another one. Not yet, huh? We should have got some phosphorus, I guess. How about you? Go at one eleven. Four. It's one over here. Five. What do we got? We got three more ground creatures, another flying creature, and then we're we should be done. Ground and flying. What? Somebody land over there? Landed pilot. Oh, nice. We can go talk to him because I'm sure nothing's going to attack us. One fourteen. There's something over there. Okay. 124. Close. We've got ground and flying and two underground. I thought I saw something flying. Okay. One ground, two underground. Oh, there's something. The 124, so we're going to have to go underground now. Really thought we'd find something here. In case you're wondering, I'm just going to make a couple batteries. I don't want plant life. I want the biological entity, thank you. Most pressure resistant? That's interesting. Never had anything like that before. Still 124. So either it's the other underground creature or nothing. Highest body temperature at 124. Right, one more underground. Nope, wrong way. Underground, yes. Okay. Okay. We got a couple more batteries. I was hoping to get that one. You got to be kidding me. It's there. It's just outside the cave. Just on the other side of this. You. Please tell me you have 140. Nope. So this isn't going to cover it. Unbelievable. Well, worth a shot, guys. So we are going to give it six more minutes. And we're going to call it. But we're going to have to go to hyperspace real quick and look for another system. I don't want another black hole. Okay, come on. Alright, what do we got? Let's check this one out. Gonna go nearby and see if we can't find something. We just need one hot creature. And then we're done. We're at 124, we need 140. 16 degrees, less than 16 degrees away from achieving the entire entire thing. But I, I seem to think that it was that planet. I should have stayed there and I should have scanned the creatures while I was there. 
Okay, looks like we got a high temperature world here. Hold on. Humid. Paradise. Bountiful. Desert. Poisonous. And swamp. Not here. I think we can get one more jump out of this. It's a lot of planets there. Let's check them out. One of them is dissonant, but that's okay. Let's see what we got. Five minutes. Five minutes to do it. This is the last... I'll tell you what. This will probably be my last jump. I don't know if I'm going to jump again. But unless I don't find a, a hot world here. If I do, great. Uh, is that a battle? Yeah, we're going to have to do this again. Watch. See? Gone. Okay, let's check out the worlds. Paradise. Bountiful. Boiling. Boiling. Flame ruptured. We got two here. Flame ruptured and boiling. Which one do we do? Let's do boiling. Teledin... Alpha. Oh, is that you? It is. Let's see what we can find. I'm hoping this will be it. And then we'll be finished. So like I said, this is it. If we can't find it here, we're going to give up. And we're going to check how much time we've got. Here we go. Down we go. Down we go. Fortunately, no aggressive sentinels here, so we don't have to worry about getting attacked. Except unless the creatures are angry at us. Um, let's go to a plateau. Something lower down. Yes. This will work. Okay. Alright. How many creatures we got here? We got eight. All of them are flying except for three that are underground, so we need a cave. Let me just see if we got a cave nearby. I want to say this is one, but yeah, it is. Incoming storm. Of course it's an incoming storm. Okay, got three of them. Four of them. And five of them. So it looks like we got all the flying creatures. Still nothing, so they don't really count towards it, I'm guessing. Hmm. I want to grab some phosphorus. Go figure. We got storm crystals here. Yeah. Yep. Activated copper, cobalt, cobalt. The ground's on fire. Yes. How hot? Five hundred eighty-eight degrees. I guess this qualifies as the hottest planet we've been on thus far. Let's just get, like, a hundred of this. It should be more than enough to get me through storms. Like I said, should be enough. There we go. There we go. Okay. Now, we need to find a cave. So what we're probably going to have to do is we're going to have to get back to our ship here. That's not the direction I want to go. It's alright. We're okay. More storm crystals. I'm tempted. I'm always tempted to just start grabbing storm crystals just because you see them and you're like, Oh, we got to grab them, got to grab them. Again, settlements, 
or some place that you can have a landing. Oh, oh, there's caves near here. Let's go ahead and do this one. It's not much, but we've got two caves right here. Okay. Again, we just need one creature. Feel bad for me. Come on. Give me a creature, please. An underground creature, not flying in the, amongst the storm that's on fire. There's one. Skin full of holes, huh? Still 124. Okay, well. You know what, guys? I think this is it. I think we're done. I'll check out the other cave real quick. We are already beyond the time limit that I gave myself on this, so... See if the other cave has anything, and if it doesn't, we're done. There we go. There you are, buddy. Is any of your, any of your friends, any other creatures near here? We've got three underground creatures. I expected to find at least one more, but it doesn't look like we're going to find them. All right. So we're going to have to call this. My guess is that it was on that planet, and I missed it. So I missed a big one. But you know what? This has been very educational. So I think we're in good shape as far as that's concerned. We have given ourselves more in regards to, you know what we can do in the future when we're faced, faced with this, when we do this uh, whole thing again. So, I think we're going to call it here. So, let me go ahead and get out. Restore. I'm just going to get him back in. There we go. And let's go ahead and exit. Alright, back to mode select. Let's see what we got. So, yeah, two and a half hours. Look at that. So, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. That was a good uh, experimental run, I think we'll call that. Uh, as far as this is concerned, I, I'm certain I can get this down to the two hour mark pretty easily, but I think, uh, unless you can find a planet nearby, unless you can find everything you need and you'd have to know all kinds of portal addresses and granted you, you should know some portal addresses, uh, you're not going to get what you need. So, um, but you, you'd have to be able to find all these planets. So I'm going to start searching around. I'll do a little more research throughout the week and check out some planets and maybe next weekend. Uh, I think next weekend will be a good weekend. We can do this with me. We'll have a live stream of it. And we'll go from there. Not a dead stream. So, all right, guys, I'm going to call it. Thank you very much for watching. Please hit the like and subscribe and we'll see you again in the future. Take care, everybody.